Woo, we're back. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another Pokemon card live stream. Oh, you guys have noticed the new emojis. Supremo says, I'm the first one to use the new chat emojis. Oh, that's so cool. That makes you cooler than everyone else. Toss this over here. You guys noticed it right away. $6 hips today? That's right. It's, it's throwback Thursday. I don't know. Is today Thursday? I don't even think today's Thursday. Kitty's in her seat. Very good. What's up going on? Well, what's going on, guys? God, I'm tired. <laughs> I fell asleep to take, like, a nap, and then the nap turned into, like, a whole thing. You know what I mean? You ever done that? So I'm pretty tired. I gotta, like, I gotta snap out of it. I'm, I'm still waking up. Oops. Kitty Art. Kitty's ready to open some Pokemon. So that's right. How's it going, Professor Vince? TCC, let's do it. The Zard Mystery. You guys want to do a Zard Mystery? Okay, but I'm going to have to make them... Uh, you know, the price he's going for on eBay, basically. Yo, yo, what's up, everyone? How's it going, Irvin? We could do a Zard mystery. You see the cards in Champion's Path. Of course, I've seen it. Everyone's like, oh, my God, check it out. It's a Charizard. Oh, my God, Charizard. That's everybody right now. So let's see. Charizard. V oh, do I have my stuff open? Yeah, VMAX. He's a 10. Uh, we'll go by lowest price. The lowest price, buy it now. Oh, that's Japanese. I was like, that's cool. All right, so the cheapest one is 600. We're just going to mimic that. You'll try and get that rainbow one. I'm going to try and get that rainbow one. All right. I don't think we need this big flap, but it doesn't matter. Where's a pen? I need a pen. So we're gonna have a Charizard game. Let me make sure Streamlabs is on. I haven't heard any noise yet. Yeah, my volume is on. Sometimes everything explodes with noise the moment we start. There we go. Okay, so we're gonna have the Charizard game. Oops. Charizard VMAX. Charizard VMAX PSA 10. And it's going to be I think it'll be $20 per spot. How about that? So it's 20 per spot. And we're going to have 30 spots. Maybe I should have done this. Hold on. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. All right. So Charizard VMAX has his own game now. And uh, let's trim the top off. It would be a huge deal if I could get any pack today. I'm 13 and can't buy the packs. If you could just do one pack for me, it would be a huge deal. All right, let's go ahead and snip the top off. Snip. TCC, put me on 7 and 17. Use my tab, says Supreme. 7 and 17, you got it. Supreme. Supreme. Good luck, mister. There you go. Toss it over there. How about that shiny Charizard from Champion's Path? He looks kind of awful, doesn't he? <laughs> so we have a Charizard VMAX mystery game going on for the custom boosters. We also have this lovely Salamence. I don't really know what he's worth. Um... I was thinking of putting him up for like 200. I think that would be very fair, actually. There's only two of these graded in the world, so might even be low. I listed them on eBay, but I put them at a really high price, and then I told people to make offers. But so far, as nobody's made an offer, so maybe they think I want too much for them. One of two in the world. That's right. There's one of two in the world of that Salamance, so we might do him later. Hey, CC. Hope you're doing well tonight. You heard the Champions Path news. Uh, yes, and I'm sure the pre, excuse me, I'm sure the pre-orders are going up pretty fast right now. Two mediums, two round, a lost thunder. You got it. Two medium spots, sir, and two rounds of lost thunder, please. Two mediums. Who was that? That was Tyler H. What's up, Tyler? Wait a second. Yeah, I did that right. Tyler H. Tyler opens Pokemon cards. 
That's the name of the new. That's the name of the channel now. Hello TCC. One spot for the V Max Zard. Snape it for me. Snape it for me. Snape. If Cheese wins the the Charizard V Max, I will cut it in half for you guys. All right. Good luck, Mister. Let's see what you got. Snape. Snape. All right. Take all these tops. Toss them over here. What's going on, guys? We're five minutes in. We got 80 viewers. Two, three, four. Cheese, don't cut a PSA. Sudwudo. Hmm. You have a box. You think it's so easy, don't you, mister? You think it's so easy, Evie. That's green. Hmm. Whoa. Celebi. Here's a Celebi Prism card. Two spots on the Zard. We got Espeons, Tapu Leles. Here's, oh my God. Is it green? Hmm. Hmm. We got Skiddo. Oh, thank God. All right, last it's chance. My so give me the number 18 on the Zard. The number 18? Oh, it's just a hollow. I'm so sorry, Tyler H. Tyler H? What's up, man? Good old Lost Thunder. Yeah, I know. I feel the same way. That's definitely a dang. Hold on. Let's get you your reverse hollows. I saw that lovely Espeon in there. Let's toss that in there. One medium and one big chungus Zard both on spot. 11 if available, please, and one round of fates. One round of fates? One round of fates. You think it's so easy. One round of fates collide. Is the Lele in there? Let's get you the Lele too. Let's get you the Lele too. So we got these three. Let's get these sleeved up. Here you go, Tyler. Yeah, that sucked, man. <laughs> you pulled two white bags and they were both hollows. Here you go, Tyler H. I hate seeing you walk away with nothing, so we gotta throw those in. Tyler hard. Tyler playing on hard mode. You got a box. All right. After Tyler H, what was going on after Tyler H? What's up, everyone? Zero Zero says, "Hey, one spot for Charizard V Max. One spot for the Charizard V Max." All right. You're gonna go on number five. Zero Zero. Live ship. I just got my last one, and I think you missed a bag I had. Interesting. Bought one of the heavy base set packs with a Mewtwo. Okay, we will take a look for that. Tyler Lambert, Super Sixteen. Two rounds, Darkness and Blaze, I have a box. Okay, Super 16. You've got a box, Super 16? I couldn't find it. I couldn't find it. I looked for it earlier. First time buyer, nice to meet you. No bag, huh? All right. All right. Wow, that machine is going off like crazy. Sneep. We're going to have an exciting night, of course. Too bad everything's sold out. Man, I, I've ordered everything. I just, I'm waiting for them to arrive, and they are taking their time sending these pokey cards out. Holy. They need to send them faster. Steep. All right. Let's see if you have any luck in the Darkness of Blaze Super 16. All right, so this is going to be green. Here's a white, oops, here's a white bag containing Scissor V Max. Sweet. Scissor VMAX. And that's green. Do I live stream every night? I think I do. When's the last time I skipped a night? I don't think I've skipped a night in well over a month. That's Mew V. Okay. Hey, mister, it's me. Go ahead and toss this down here. Green. Green. And green. All right, your pulls are the Scissor V Max and the Mew V. Super 16. He's so super. One spot on the Chungo Zard, sir. Somewhere under 15, please. Somewhere under 15. Who's going to win the Fat Chungus? Super 16. Super de duper. I'll move this up here. All right, so I'm going to put this in the book pile for now. I'll get sorted after the live stream's over. Max, please, sir, and thank you. No problem. 
Thank you. Slither in that bud. Simple. Targon. Is it Targon that was speaking earlier? I got this bag for Targon here. I wonder if it was Targon who was speaking earlier about the live shipping. Sneaky sup. The super. Is super up here? Super, did we ship you by chance? If we shipped you, you don't you don't have a box anymore. Supreme, C Shintani. That's how it works. You don't get like a permanent box. Scooter. Let me go see if we've already shipped you, Super. If you've already been shipped, you don't have a box anymore. It's weird. I looked for your box today, ablaze. actually. And one I couldn't medium, find it. One large. We never left. We are stuck in a loop. That's right. That's correct. We never even left. I didn't ask for shipping, but I don't know how it works, so maybe it shipped. No worries. Well, let me hold on. Let me go see then, because maybe I haven't shipped you, but I don't see your bag, and I didn't see your box earlier. He said he didn't ask for shipping. Hmm. Then we should not have shipped you if you haven't asked for it. So let's go. Let's go looking for it real fast, though. Okay, we have. According to this, we have not shipped you. Hmm. If we have not shipped you, you would be right here. God, I hate being on a goose hunt. Let's see. Tyler. Toonami. Lambert. Tyler. Wait, is this also Tyler H? This is also Tyler H. Let's combine these real fast. Make our lives easier. <laughs> I didn't realize you had a bag already, Tyler. Here you go, Tyler. All right, so let's try that again. Let's see. Toonami. Tyler Lambert. Sam 2. Sky Bluebird. Slytherin. Top Cheese, Simple, Snorlax95, Targon, Sneaky Sub, Scott Burke, Timothy Clay, Super 16, you were the very last bag. I didn't think, I didn't think I'd check the very last bag. Usually the very last bag is held by somebody who hasn't bought cards in a really long time. So that's why I didn't see you. There you go. <laughs> we found you. You were just at the very, very end. Ooh, I wonder if I could keep the... ST box there. All right, cool. Let's move on to the next one. That goose hunt. The goose hunt. Irvin, what's up, Irvin? He says two spots on the Zard. Random, you choose. Okay, Irvin. If I choose, so we have this Charizard game going on, and it sounds like it's going to be over very quickly. You're going to be here on six and four. All right. I'll take live shipping in one of all Ardenan, it's my birthday. Give me number 18 on the Zard. All right, Ardenan. What? A in the chat, please. Can I get an A in the chat? Titanic online. One medium, one big chungus, one and spot 11 if available, ablaze, and one round of fates. All right. First time by a long time. Follower from Monster Hunter. Follower from Monster Hunter. How's it going, man? You guys excited for Fatalis? We got one monster coming, Fatalis, and then the game's over. They're gonna, they're not gonna support it anymore, which I think is a disappointment. I think they should have supported it all the way to the next monster hunter. Titanic in the medium. He said he wants a round of Fates Collide. Fates Collide. But you could kind of feel it, couldn't you? You could kind of feel that they weren't supporting the game too well with Diceborne. It was kind of obvious. Okay, so this is the backmost one. Let me put this back. Tyler says, I think you missed me. You read my name but didn't put me on Charizard. No, I, I didn't miss you. Give me lucky 13 on the Charizard. Maybe I did. <laughs> I thought I... I thought I... Uh, which one are we on? Hmm, interesting. Here, let's put you on this one. T right here, Tyler Lambert. Ta-da! Weird. I, I, I must just be imagining things. I better shake this sleeve enough off. What's up? He says, miss me too on Zard. All right, I'm putting you on right now, Taboas. Sneep. Let's get this for Titanic. Sneep. Sneep. He says, thanks, haha. -ha. You read me, but you didn't put me on. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. So Titanic, what do you got? Oh, Bronzong, huh? All right. Bronzong break card? I suppose that's better than being a purely green pack, right? Hmm. Pack number two. Two smalls for me, one Chungus spot for Zubi and Jesse. What? One Chungus spot? This Chungus, I can't believe how fast you guys are hammering the Chungus. You guys are just going right at it. 
How long are your videos? Uh, they're about three minutes long. We got Seal and Del Fox. Hmm, that's interesting. Saw the PSA submissions, but si didn't see my Shiny Zard in it. That's because your Shiny Zard's not in it. Ta-da! All right, so Genesect EX. Shiny Zard hasn't gone out yet. He's going to go out soon. Hey, mister. Okay, so this was for Titanic. Let's go find Titanic's bag. Tyler Hardister, Sky Toonami, Tyler Lambert. Hmm, maybe I will have these boxes out of order. I like having this box right next to me because this is one of the busiest boxes. It's the QRS, uh, the ST box. Give me 12 and 23 on Zard VMAX. Zard VMAX? You think it's so easy, huh? You think it's so easy. I can just give you a spot on Zard B Max. Hmm? All right. Let me make sure I didn't miss anyone else around, Tyler. No, I didn't. So, Irvin, Ardenan, Titanic, Asian Tim, Darkness Ablaze, I have a box. All right. Darkness Ablaze. What's going on, Asian Tim? I know you got a box, Asian Tim. You're the easiest one to remember. <laughs> You're the easiest one to remember. Sneep. Sneep. All right. And the last Sneep. Sneep. Darkness of Balls is basically all I have right now. <laughs> I've got a few other sets, but it's like a lot of them are sold out. We've got green. Green. You got sleep today? A little bit. It, it was kind of like messed up sleep, though. I got a little bit of sleep. Green. Ooh. What do we get? That's Houndoom V. Houndoom V is the hot pull here. Come on. There we go. They don't like to sit up against that pencil. Pen, I mean. Oops, I didn't mean to grab two bags. Thanks for letting me wink on TikTok last night. <laughs> Who were you playing against? Lambert, Tyler, Limehouse? I think you were winning, right? <laughs> Asian Tim. Darkness ablaze to hidden fates. I have a box. One spot on Expedited PSA submissions are really expensive. I could uh, show you guys the math in the Discord server I did earlier. They're quite expensive. Asian Tim, I think I put you up top. Mm -hmm. So I think what I, I'm going to rearrange the order of these. The G box is going to be on the far left because it's. It's the least used box, it's the G box. And the A box is going in the middle because it's the most used box. That and the, uh, the ST box is one of the most used. Okay, so let's see if we can find Asian Tim. Cirque, Cap JP, Andy Dell, Cap JP. Wait, I didn't see Cap JP twice, right? Asian Tim, found your bag. Look at that lovely slow poke side up. So beautiful. Do you ever get tired? I'm always tired. <laughs> JT Sarad, live ship. I just got my last one, and I think you missed a bag. Okay, JT Sarad says I might have missed one of his. Let's take a look, man. He says I just got mine, and I didn't see one of my bags. Jake's JR Collision, Julian, Jared, Lacey, Joe Mama, Kiljolts, Justin R, Jared. Benny, JC. Oh, I got JC's cards over here. Louis O. Louis O is somebody who needs to get shipped. He's been here for a while. I might just see if I have his address and just ship him whether he wants to be shipped or not. Here's five dollars. Give me a hug and tell me I matter, please. Hug, you matter. Kenny Freeze, LSX Scott, Logs, John Bright, Killjolts, Jir Khan, Glass Classic, JT Sarad, right here. JT Sarad. All right. So you would like the live ship, no problem. Let's see. Don't forget my Zard entry and my round of DA. No problem. Let's get this first. Oh no, I forgot. May I see the list for base set two? Uh, Maybe in a minute. 
Let me focus on the list. Let me focus on the Streamlabs list. Okay, so we got really good protection for it there. When you have a really valuable pack like that, we like to do extra protection. Pass that there. It was full of issues. Have you heard or experienced anything with Cosmic Eclipse? No, I, I don't know what you mean. Issues? You mean like it wasn't full of Charizard? I mean, that's a pretty big issue to me. If it's not full of Charizard, I don't, I don't see what the point is. Okay. We should do different packs. If we get it side by side, chances of hot pulls are lower. Oh, Gerard using his head, huh? That's clever. So he says do five packs from two different sets, huh? Don't forget to breathe. <gasps> Push! <laughs> Have any Ultra Prism left? We got plenty of Ultra Prism left. Ultra Prism and Lost Thunder were both restocked. It's the other stuff I wish we could get already. Where's my Cosmic, man? People love Cosmic. Do we still have more Cosmic? I don't know about that. Where is my Cosmic Eclipse? Okay, let me plug in my printer. First live ship of the night. JT, JT it's on the way. Live shipping, please, Mike Powell. Mike Powell, what's up, Mike Powell? All right, your label's printed. Live shipping is popular. Oh, I haven't changed the price for pre-grading. Don't buy it. I am going to change the price. Pre-grading takes way too long. The live shipping probably won't change. I want to keep it low because people, they deserve to get shipped. And hold on. Let me throw this, this thing away. Give me a second here. I've been using this, like, block under the chair to push my chair backwards. And it's been really useful. One Ultra Prism opening, please. One Ultra Prism opening? All right, JT, you're taking care of. Who's after JT? It is. Hold on. Who's the other guy who says he hasn't been taken care of? Tyler H. Zero, zero. Tyler Lambert. Super. Irvin. Ardenan. Titanic. Asian Tam. JT. Surad. No, I haven't missed anyone. So, the next guy is Louis Rivera. One pack of hidden. One round of darkness ablaze. First time buyer. All right. We got these lovely overpriced Hidden Fates. Let's go ahead and get one open. Let's get a Hidden Fates open. Hidden Fates. Their price is uh, pretty ridiculous. Pretty ridiculous. Don't go too crazy on the hips, guys. Now, Darkness Ablaze. You could have another round of Darkness Ablaze, basically. Here we are. Buyer. First time buyer. Nice to meet you, mister. Sneep. Nice to meet you, mister. Sneep. We had 4.7 thousand viewers yesterday. How do you guys feel about that? That's pretty wild, right? Like, it's become just a normal thing for me because I stream so much. But I, I was thinking about it the next day. I'm like, 4,000 4, viewers. That's like better than some uh, Twitch, like kind of like big Twitch streamers. And we don't even have like, we don't have that many subs on this channel. It's really wild. He says, what was a good show last night? Oh, I'm glad. Your mom warned you about me. Let's see. He did not buy a bulk box. So what do we got? We got green, green. Two cool packs, huh? How do I get a Pokeball next to my name? You got to become a member of the channel. Speaking of which, we have two new emojis. Do you guys want to show off the emojis for, for members? I know you guys do. I know you want to show them off. You can become a member for $2 a month. It's not too bad. And uh, it gives you a loyalty badge that kind of it becomes better over time. It starts out as a Pokeball, turns into a Master Ball. So you can get a, a loyalty badge, but also you get access to exclusive emojis like Spank. Irvin's using Spank right now. <laughs> he says, that's my favorite. <laughs> we also added Brock. Yeah, you can see Brock next to it. <laughs> hey, Mr. Darkness, the ball's in the small. All right, so Crobat from Darkness. 
What do we got from Hibben Fates? You guys want a code? Here's a code. Three, four. <laughs> ah, it looks cold. It is cold. I'm sorry, mister. So, Crobat's going to be your pull. Careful with those hidden guys. They're way too expensive. Okay? So, with one pack of hidden, you could buy two rounds of darkness. So, think about that. I mean, what I meant was, is basically the cost. He, he could have, in this case, had two rounds of darkness. They're pretty close. So, let's see. Your name is Louis Rivero. We got two Louis now. We got Louis Rivero and Louis Cab. Louis Rivero. I like Louis. It's a good name. Louis. Rivero. This is why full names are so important. It's because it uh, ensures that you don't get mixed up with another person. One round of face collision for Tiki Taka. Tiki Taka. All right, we got the Tiki Taka starting. Rudy Tab, what's up, man? One spot on the Chunko Zard. Does it say which spot? Somewhere under 15. Okay. Rudy Tav. All right, there we go. We got a new member right now. Who's that? Taboas? What's up, man? Is it Taboas? Taboas. One spot for the Charizard. All right, well, there you are. Taboas. Only one person will walk away with the Zard, and he will be a happy camper because that Zard goes for $600 right now. Chief says, spot on the medium. If I win, we cut all the hits. Oh, oh my Lord, Chief. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. Cheese. Unbroken. Maddie Merck. One round of darkness of blades, one medium, one large. Maddie Merck. One medium. One large. Oh, for those of you who didn't catch it, this is the large right now. It's Blastoise Piplop. He's pretty cute. All right. He also wants a round of Darkness Ablaze. All right. I think these are the lucky ones. Matty Merck, are you ready? You're in the right place. You got the lucky ones. Maybe. <laughs> we'll find out. When's the stream, TCC? Uh, probably in about 30 minutes. You have to take a tap tapu poo poo. Be sure to get some of those Pokemon bulk card toilet papers together. Would you guys like that if I used, uh, if I made like toilet paper rolls out of bulk cards, sold down on the channel? That'd be cool. I think I overpaid. Did you? Maddie Merck. Yep, you overpaid by $10. <laughs> Oh, Matty Merck, what would you like me to do with that, Matty Merck? You know what I could do? I could scratch you out of the large and put you in the Charizard VMAX game if you prefer. What do you think? Or I could give you two spots. And he says, can you put me on the Zard? All right, that's exactly what we're doing. That's exactly my idea. We had the same idea. It's because we're so smart. We got Darumaka. Wait, I did that wrong. All right. What do we have here? Oh, a white back. Wonder if this could be secret rare. No, it's just full art. <laughs> Some boxes don't have secret rares. How about that? And that that's a cruel joke. Maddie Merck, you end up with Butterfree V Max full art. Bond sweet. Toss this over here. Lunatone. Maddie Merck. You have an M in your name. One spot on the chubs at number 11, if possible. And here we are, Maddie Merck. What card? Oh, look, you got the uh, V and now the full art. Gerard, did you buy multiple or one? <laughs> so, Maddie Merck, let's put you here. Maddie M. And then I'll go scratch you out of the large real fast. Okay. Tyler H. Two rounds of Darkness Balls, and I'm done for the night. All right. Time for the good luck for Tyler H. One, two, three, four, five. This will be the box. This will be the hot box. Whoops. You guys all trying to have the best pulls <laughs> on TikTok? Let's see. Oops. 
What is up, Devin A? One more spot of the czar, please, mister. Please, mister? You can't just call me mister. You can't use my... You can't use that name. My true name. Steep. One, two, three, four. Five... Yeah, five, six. <laughs> Seven, eight. Nine, ten. All right. V Max. Good luck, Tyler H. Starting out with the green. What do we got? We got Zvilus. Hmm. Ah, here we go. Hmm. Hollow pink urchin. Hmm. Oh, here we go. You don't get paid till Tuesday. Santa Scorch V. Place that there. So the small with the dark Vaporeon got drawn last night because when the stream ended, I don't know, did it? Step bro. That's green. You put his... Oh, you are correct. Thank you, mister. Thank you, mister. So many similar names. So many similar names. Why are you getting so many hollows right now, Tyler H? Where are the hot pulls? You're getting all the hollows. Here we go. This will be secret rare. Your house could burn in the wildfire, dude. Don't tell me that. Your house better stay nice, mister. Here we go. Cabo Full Art. Yeah. Man, that sucks. Also, t tonight at 12, uh, we jump into 9-11. Oh, man. It's been so many years since the attack on the Twin Towers of New York. What a sad day. I wish I had a Butterfree VMAX, though, says Mark. <laughs> We've got Got the Tuh. That's your third what? Cabu? What you're saying is we could run a train on Tyler Ridge? Okay, let's see. <laughs> a Hollow Dracovich. Oh, my God. That's way too many hollows. So you end up with two Vs and a full art. I, that sounds about right. That sounds about right. Where are the secret rares? Okay, toss this over here. Mark Ortiz. I must be going nuts. Sorry, Maddie Merck. We'll get that. We'll get that fixed. So Maddie Merck, first of all, let's get him in his right bag. First of all. Sorry about that, Maddie Merck. Whoa. Whoa, everything's collapsing. Whoa. Not enough room on the table. Really? Not enough room on this table. I need a bigger table. Someday. Now, these will go into Tyler's bag. Five years married. What? Time to get a new model. Time to get the latest model. I'm teasing you. Let's see. Whew. Red Flare. Hey, mister. I'll take live shipping. One of all the mystery. I'm getting busy, but we'll try my hardest to watch most of your streams that I can. All right. For, oh, I see. The leftover five is probably four. So let's see. One of all the mysteries. We've got Red Flare. Red Flare probably doesn't realize that there's a, too many mysteries. There's a bonus mystery going on that's not talked about. It's this Chungus mystery. Red Flare. Mister, she gave me 70 to spend on here. Mister, the wife finally released my... <laughs> I'm not going to say that. So let's see. That's 30. Is that 30? But he's got 45. Hmm. I don't really know where he wants to spend his last $10. Because neither of these are $10. So those are both $20. She let them out. <laughs> Did she let you out of your cage? <laughs> Can you put me on the Chungus instead of the large? Yes. That's the second time I've done that now. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> this card's going to look all messed up. Two spots on medium 11 and 12. So Red Flare would also like... Red Flare, wouldn't it make sense to do the live shipping after the game's ended? I feel like that would make more sense. Because if you win one, aren't you going to want to you know, have it sent out right away? 
Let me know if you still want me to ship you right now. I can save the live shipping for you for later if you prefer. Hey, Mr. Did you get my deep pot in the mystery? It's Muff. Muff? Muff, you're going to have to wait your turn. So, Red Flare, you answer that question. Tebos says one round of darkness ablaze. All right. Tebos. He says, yeah, sure. Okay, so Red Flare, you are owed live shipping. Just remind me, and I'll trust you. Just be like, hey, I paid for live shipping, and we didn't use it right away. Okay, because, you know, you're going to win the Charizard VMAX, Red Flare. So, you probably want him to go out with your other stuff. Sleep. Mister, would you like to own that Kabu? It could be yours for the low price of one more round of Darkness of Balls. I wish, but he's a dude. You know, I can't go deep for a dude. Quip's sitting right over there. She'd have no respect for me if I did that. <laughs> She'd be like, what? What do we got? We got Mimic You. Wait, I paid for 12. You paid for 12? What are you talking about, Greg? I paid for 12. What'd you say, Greg? Tell Quip I said hi. They're saying hi to you, Quip. Stay away from my wife. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> That's green. He says it's 2020. That's true. I paid to be on spot 12. Oh, but Red Flare got there first. I'm sorry. That's how it works, mister. That is how it works. It's got to be your turn when I put you on the spot that you want. I'll put you on 14. How about that? That's, that'll be nice. Tabo's perfectly cold. Welcome to the live stream, Tabo's, where you can pull all greenbacks. Ah. <laughs> he goes, boo. I'm sorry, Tabo's. Don't worry, you'll win this. Let's see who's next. L Wines. Two spots in the small. All right, L Wines. I'm sorry, mister. L Wines and L Wines. Gerard, two smalls for me. All right. One chunk of spot for Subby. Whoa, Gerard going deep, huh? So Gerard on 16. And then Gerard on 24. What's after that? Then we have one chunk of spot for Subby and one for Jess E. Wow. So this be Jess E on three. Wow, if these guys win, they're going to have to call you daddy. All right, Subby and Jesse are in, thanks to Gerard. Gregory, Gregory Coe, give me spots 12 and 23. What's up, Greg? Two rounds of heavens, please be hot. Greg C. Greg C. Tyler Limehouse, two rounds of darkness balls, two hidden fates. I have a box, one spot on those art. All right, Tyler Limehouse coming back in to go very deep. Number 14, PSA Chard. PSA Chard. All right, Tyler Limehouse, you've been having a lot of luck lately. Let's see if the luck continues. Let's see if the luck, luck continues for Tyler Limehouse. I pay for medium, says Cheese. You're in the medium, Cheese. He says, no, I asked for 15. <laughs> it's too late. Too late. Sneep. One, two. Sneep. One Zard, Mr. Sneep. Please. Sneep. <laughs> Devin says, geez, don't be that guy. <laughs> Rest in peace to the 3,000 people that died on 9 11. It's very sad. It's very sad. Some people did something. Oh, man. All right, here we go. Tyler Limehouse. You got it, mister. All secret rares for Tyler. We got Galarian Slowbro. He did really well yesterday because those boxes were hot. And I said they were hot. And people stopped opening them. And then he came in. He's like, I'll open some. And he immediately gets two, two secret rares. Green. Green. Oh, but the first round of darkness, not so hot. What's up, Russ? Russ became a member. All right. Now you're going to get that special Pokeballs when the first month passes. So the first upgrade to your Pokeball, Nick. Oh, look at that. You did get a secret rare. Picking up secret rare Rose. First upgrade to the Pokeball with the membership is it, it turns into the Great Ball. And there's an Eternatus VMAX. They were side by side. Look at that. That's crazy. Side by side. Now your 10 packs were worth it all of a sudden, huh? 
See, if he had only purchased five in this case, he would have just gotten the slow bro, and the next person would have got Rose Eternatus. Very lucky. Okay, let me set that to the side for a moment. Here we go. What do we got here? Oh. What else we got? Oh, that was a hot pack there, too. Shiny Ralts. He's not, like, super crazy valuable. However, the Secret Rare Birds is going to be a decent pull on the Hidden Fates. All right. And finally, what do we have here? It's cold. This last pack is cold. That's not surprising. Okay. What a nice pack. I agree. What a nice boy. God, why is this? I want to pull like one bag and it pulls like three bags out for me. Jesus. One more round of DA and then I am broke. One more round of DA and then I am pokey rich. Tyler, lime. Tyler. I can't live ship you if you ask for live shipping. You've got too much stuff, mister. So what I can do for live shipping is I could probably send you your specialty bag, but if you ever ask for live shipping, it would take too long. Just want to keep that in mind. All right, look at that. Rose, Moltreceptus, Moltreceptus, Articuno. We got Turnitus, VMAX. Very good. Five, small mister, mister, going deep. Did he just say mister, mister? <laughs> You've already got the birds. That's funny. You got two birds now. You got twee birds. Okay. We're done with Tyler Limehouse. Who's after Tyler Limehouse? Zach Najin. What's up, Zach? Can you pre-grade my Charizard and Mewtwo from DP, please? And thank you. Okay, Zach. You will have a bag over here. Let's see. Z-Boy... Zanesk, Vicious, William, XOXO, Zach Najin. Are you up top, Zach? Maybe Zach's up top. Oh, I'm sorry. That's the overflow box. Let me put that back. Oh, there it is. All right. So that Zach wants a pre-grade on his entire bag. No, I'm kidding. All right. So he's got this Charizard and this Mewtwo, and he'd like to know more about them. Let's just see if there's anything else worth considering real fast. I want to pick some out that look okay. Oh, I see. So you've already had a pre-grade before. Interesting. Well, you got a huge bag, Zach. We can ship that, Zach. Just get yourself into the... Uh... Oh, you know what? You're probably holding off to send them off to grade, weren't you? So these were already in the higher part of the pre-grade, so those are already a good, a good uh, pull. Let's go ahead and Put this back. Set that there for the moment. God damn it. These little baggies are so annoying. Okay, let's check out your Mewtwo. He looks okay on the front, maybe slightly off center. And on the back, we see that the top is thick, so he's no good. How about the Charizard? All right. It's kind of the same deal. He's definitely thicker up top. Um... He might be high enough price as a 10 that it's, it's worth trying. I'm also concerned about that little dot. See that? I've got to get some decent pulls before I'm done. LMAO, two more rounds of dark balls. My belief on these is that they should be 9s. However, you could submit them anyways and see if they come out as 10s. They always have a small chance that PSA ignores a flaw. Kind of like with that test tube Mewtwo. Remember that? That was clearly not a 10, and they turned it into a 10. So there's always a chance... Usually, the, the decision whether or not to send it off has to do with how much money it sells for. So if it's a really high-value card, go ahead and send it in anyways. If it's not a high-value card, don't risk it because you, you don't want a 9 to come back. Titanic says, one more fates collide. Let's get that Umbreon or Alakazam. All right. Try again, huh? Hoping my cherry. To me. Poping my cherry. Oh my god. <laughs> Suck it to me. You're popping your pokey cherry? That should be a title. Popping our pokey cherries. That should definitely be a title. <laughs> All right, here we go. Good luck, Titanic. Fossil excavation kit. <laughs> oh, dear Lord. Oh, what'd you get? Oh, this is going to be Team Rocket's handiwork. Team Rocket's handiwork full art. Next pack. So that's a full art. 
Do you still have that PSA Dark Charizard? What are you talking about? The eight? I've got a I've got an English eight, and I had a Japanese eight that sold. But you know, I would be open minded actually to selling the English eight as well. It's one I graded myself, so I kind of wanted to just hold on to it. But got to pay that tax man. So I'm I'm willing to let go of some cards that normally I would not let go of. TCC, I'm special now. I have a membership now. I really can wink, wink, nudge, nudge. That's right. <laughs> okay, so you did pull a full art. It was Team Rocket's handiwork, though, so maybe not the one you were hoping for. But you did pull a full art. Very good. Titanic, I still got you up top. God, that's annoying. It's because your bag's so large, right? Yeah, you got a really large bag. So you have to stay up top. All right. Hey, TCC, kitty check. You guys want to see the kitty? She sleeps here the whole time. I don't know how. We're so noisy. I think she's very lonely. She tries to be like, she tries to be affectionate with me all day and I kind of just push her away because I'm so busy. <laughs> so let's see, Bull City, Charizard Mystery Pack. You got it, Bull City. What's up, man? Bull City, you're, you're being put on the coveted spot number one. Wouldn't that be funny? We open the first pack, instant win, Bull City. Cheese says, here's $5. Give me a hug and tell me I matter, please. Hug. <laughs> Mike Powell says, live ship. Mike Powell. All right, Mike Powell. Mike Powell. Here's Mike Powell. Mike Powell, did you have any PSA cards? A round of Rebel Clash, I have a box. I don't think Mike Powell had any PSA cards. I'm pretty sure he did not. All right, let's snip. What is your cat's name? My cat's name is literally just Kitty. That's it. Toss it over there. Okay, there we go. Put some energy cards in there. The energy cards help safe, keep the cards safe. No PSA cards, says Mike Powell. That's why I thought. I couldn't remember any with the Mike Powell on them. Did I do this right? Yeah, I did. Okay, good. Okay, give me a minute. You're going to hear the tape dispenser in a second here, guys. Oops, come on now. Do the highest donor for a week get a free card? No, they do not. No, they do not. However, there is a very special role in the Discord called Pokey Rich, and it goes to the person who's the highest donor for the month. So we hand out 12 of those a year if you think about it. So it's a pretty difficult to obtain role. Two rounds of Rebel Clash. Make it love to my ear balls. Pokey Chan, you need a tape emote. <laughs> so in order to unlock the next emojis, there's the way the way it works on YouTube is you get more emojis when you have more members. The next round of emojis gets unlocked at 23 members. We'd need we'd need a, an additional 23 members just to unlock another emoji. So that's a pretty pretty tall hill to climb. We might be able to reach it one day. Might take us a week. I don't know. 23 is a lot. All right, so One Mike Powell. One round of fate collide, please. Let's all the cause am. I have Vulcan bag on table. Mike Powell, I need you to contact me with your address. I'm going to start looking for you. Mike Powell. So Mike Powell, the problem is I don't have your address. What I need you to do is I need you to message me right away. Message me right away on Dis uh, Discord, and I can get your label made. Okay, so Mike Powell, you're packed, but you're not shipped. I need your address. Who's next? Smargs, what's up, Smargs? He says, one Ultra Prism opening, please. Smargs, I don't recognize your name. Are you new, Smargs? Let's see, where's my Ultra Prism? Good luck, Smargs. 
How many spots left in the base set? Two packs. Uh, there's... I, we're getting closer to having half the box sold. I think we have currently one-third of the box sold. I asked for 15 on those art. Can I get 16? All right, we're putting you on 30. Sleep. Let's see. Smarks. First pack is green. You have a bulkless bag. Thanks, Smarks. Gosh, these cards are constantly just falling down. May I see the list? You could see the list. That would be interesting. What if you could see that list? That'd be crazy. And another green. All right. Unfortunately, Smarks, they were green. Oh, but wait a second. You got a dark right prism star. We're going to throw that in for sure. That looks cool as hell. Okay, toss this up here. Smarks, Smarks. I do not see a Smarks. So I'm going to guess. I'm going to guess that Smarks might be up here. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's the uh, that's this guy. Hold on, I gotta have a different spot for him. PSA 10 two spots number 16 number 194 hidden fates. Hidden fates. Smarks, you said you had a bag. Did you really have a bag, Smarks? Nate. All right. When I buy in store packs, how can I know that I'm getting a good card? Uh, there is no way to know. All right, Smarks, I didn't see a bag for you. Let me know if I misunderstood, Smarks. He says I definitely have a bag. Okay, hmm. Let's check up top. Oh, you do have a bag, Smarks. It's so weird. <laughs> wonder why I would put that in the overflow box. Probably because this ST box is always too full. It's almost always too full. It's like, it's right now, it's too full. Weird. Toss it over there. Let's see. Nope, Smarks, they're all mine now. Let's see. Math says, hey, mister, I'd like a spot on the medium. I'm a first-time buyer. Nice to meet you, Math. So we've got Math. Good luck. Scott Burke, what's oh, up, man? Please, I have a bag. Scott Burke wants into the small. Scott Burke. And he wants around darkness of balls. I gave you 40 for two spots on the Zard. Not sure how it works. Not sure how it works. Nachos. He said nachos. He said nachos have to work. I agree. Nachos should stop parasiting off the system and they should just get to work already. Nachos have to work. Toss this over here. All right, you ready? Pack number one. Hmm. Wait a second. So, yeah, Scott Burke, you don't have a box? I have a bag. Okay, he's got a bag. How long is the wait? The wait is currently 20, 29 minutes. 29 minutes, and I'm moving super fast. So I'm going as fast as I can to stay on top of it. Why are you watching then, Logan? Logan! Was Logan giving us poo poo stinky time? Send that man to, to Pokey Hell. Send him back to Pokey Stan. I will sacrifice my own life for po Pokey Stan. No, Mom, I'm watching the Devil Animal Card Guy again. <laughs> what? What do we got? We've got Rhyperior. There you go, Scott. Shut your mouth, Logan. I wish Mr. Beast would buy me a base hat booster box. <laughs> Okay, so, hmm. Actually, you know, the three least important boxes could go on the right. And the most important ones should go on the left is what should happen. So let's find, man, top cheese actually should go up top. Slither in that butt, Sky Blue Bird, Sam 2, Tyler Lambert, Toonami, Sky Blue. Was that two Sky Blues? Tyler Hardister, Simple, Snorlax, Targon's Tavern. Targon's Tavern should go up top. Sneaky Sup. Scott Burke. All right, Scott Burke. I will sacrifice my own life for P Pokistan. Given fates, BBY. BBY? 
I'm not into... Okay, I am into BBWs. Let's see. We'll put this back. Let's see. Math Scott Gerard. One round of Fates Collide. For Tiki Taki. Oh, okay. For Tiki Taki. I was about to open them up. That's Gerard, right? Five Fates Collide. Was in the smallest go-round? Definitely some Pokemon cards. You can at least assume that there's definitely going to be Pokemon cards. I mean, it's... I will be Violet. <laughs> I'll be Violet. <laughs> Gerard, C63, Brian. Unbroken bondage. All right. Where's my unbroken bonds? He says, I have a box. You've got a box. You're the most epic Pokemon. Pokemon. All right, here's our unbroken bonds. Sneep. One, two, and three. I'm Sky Bluebird. I have two bags. You got two bags? Can I have them? I'm looking for two bags. What do we got? We've got the Dene GX. Beautiful. It looks well centered too. This uh, this is actually gradable. I think he goes for like fifty as a ten, and another green. Oh, another white. I mean, but it's just hollow. Okay, there goes C C sixty three Brian. Say your name. Women. Ugh. I only date men. Let's go ahead and wrap this up. Ugh. C sixty three Brian. I bought a spot on the Chubzard. Did I get skipped? Did I get skipped? So let's see. Day, day, knee. Who do we have this for? C63 Brian. He's going to be over here. So he will be in this bag. Cheese. Wow, Cheese really sniped that waifu out of there, didn't he? Ardenan, Christian Metal, C63 Brian. We found you. We're so glad you're here. There you go, mister. It's not a terrible pull. I think that's a decent pull for three packs. Who's next? I sharp. One spot on the Chubs are number 11. All right, we'll put you on number 21. I barely breathe. I sharp. You're on 16. Taboas. One more spot of the Zard. Here you go, Taboas. Remember not to go too deep, guys. Only buy as many spots as you're willing to lose. Peter Lee, one spot. You got it, Peter Lee. Lee! Peter Lee. Blastoise Buddy, one spot in the large, one spot on the Chubby Boy, Chubby Chard. All right, Blastoise Buddy with the easy snipe. Dude, if you actually did win that, that would be insane. I don't know what to say. So we're going to put you on six. Rudy Tav, the fat Charizard on 15. Rudy, you're on 22. Onyx expected. One round, fates collide. Wait, battle with Gerard. Oh, I see what's going on. Okay, I better have this much. I'm running low on the fates, so hopefully I have this much. Onyx expected. His name's Unexpected. Say it right. Fates. You want that BBC. You want that girl. Forget about that Coke bottle figure. This is the Coke bottle figure right here. You see that? That's the Coke bottle figure, right? Everyone's familiar with the Coke bottle figure. You want the good Gatorade jug. Mmm, give me the Gatorade jug. Woo! I'm getting hot and sweaty right now. Holy. Where's the Gatorade jug figure? Toonami says two spots, PSA 10, VMAX Charizard, and two hips. Whoa, you got the expensive stuff, mister. Good luck, Toonami. Toonami. Can't guarantee you that win. He knows what he's doing. He's a big boy. That thick wig. That's right. Now, where's my hips? Here are my hips. Gatorade figure all the way. May I see the list for base set two? You could see the list for base set two. That would be possible. But then you're going to look at it and say, eh, I don't want it. So I'm just going to keep it back there. All right, here we go. Let's see. We'll place this over here. One, two, three, four. He's going to be like, eh, I don't want it. Butterfree. 
I just wanted you to show me the list, mister. I didn't want to actually do anything. And Graveler, perfectly cold. I'm sorry, mister. I'm sorry, mister, sister. Stay away from those hidden face, guys. Who's next? J Dog, two spots on the mead. J Dog. If you're saying his right, name right, did he say two spots? J Dog. J Dog. I want to see that list so that I can skip buying stuff. Rudy Tab, two rounds of Hibben. Oh man, you guys are still buying Hibben, huh? I'm not understanding. Did Mike Powell contact me, by the way? Let's see. Do we have a Mike Powell? We do have a Mike Powell. So I'm ready to finish that shipping for you, Mike Powell. All right. So let's see. Once again, this is for Rudy Tav. He says, I have a box. You have a box? That's not allowed. Hey, mister, do you like Charizard? Can I see the list now? I'm looking for the list. I'm definitely not going to buy a spot. I just want to see it. I just want to see it with my eyes. You have a box. You have a box with a cold pack and a... Come on. And another cold pack. Onyx GX. Woo! We love Hidden Fates. You guys excited for Champion's Path to cost as much as Hidden Fates? Because that's happening. That's definitely happening. That's going to happen easily. Rudy, Ricky, what is it? Ricky, Ricky, Tabby? Is that what it is? Rudy, Rudy, Tabby. Rudy, Tav. I don't remember. Hey, mister, do you have Champion's Path yet? That's right. We have it right now. Hey, mister, where's the Champion's Path? Oh, man, I just really want it. Do you have it yet? Do you have it early? You're a YouTuber, right? You got it early, right? All right, there you go, Rudy Tav. My brother works at Walmart, and he's going to hide some Champion Path for me. Nice. That's called Walmart privilege, and it disgusts me. I'm just kidding. Let's see. We're shipping Mike Powell now. Mike Powell's been waiting this whole time. Let's get his label done. He paid for live shipping. We couldn't finish it earlier. Okay. All right, I'm going to assume your name. You're supposed to provide a name, okay? Let's see, we're going to jump up here. I think I know what your name is based on your email. Okay. Let's get the email. Oh, thank you, Mike. Let's see. We're making a label, everyone. What the hell? All right, let's see. I hit this button and then it goes print. Your cards are on the way, Mike. Your cards are on the way. In the future, Mike, you can always use the please ship list in the Discord to get your cards. That's what we do. There's a channel called the please ship channel. You just throw your name in there, and I work my way down that list, okay? We might have implemented it right after you bought cards, so you might not have ever known. And if that's the case, I apologize. There's a few people who they had purchased cards a while back. They never learned about the uh, police ship list, and it's been tough on them. I apologize, Mike. So let's see who's next. We finished J-Dog. We finished Rudy Tab. Christian Moss, number 14 for the PSA Zard. Christian Moss. Christian Moss. I don't think so. I can't believe this is sold out almost. Whoa, you guys are going deep on this. Christian Moss. Does your brother work in the Walmart in the hood? So Mike Lamb says, let's do some live shipping. I have two to three bags, one medium spot. Mike Lamb. All right. So let's start here. Mike Lamb. He thinks he has two to three bags. Is that what he said? 
I have two to three bags. That doesn't sound right. I can understand two bags, but three bags? That seems excessive. That doesn't sound like me. Matty Merck, Noguchi. Okay, so there's Mike Lamb. Moist Man, Manny, Overcharged, Unexpected, Adnan. I gotta ship Adnan soon. Marius Ladd, Matthew, Mary Kay, Otto, Martin Garcia, Mary Kay, Miguel, Matty Merck, MMC, Maximum Ride, Opens by Austin. Opens by Austin. He needs to get his booty in here. So we got one bag for you so far. And this is how thick it is. All right, that's what it looks like. I'm going to check over here. That's Tyler Elliott, Saul Shigoya, Casey Anderson. I'm going to check the other pile. Give me a second. We got Casey Anderson again, Opie Breloom, Sean Miller. Ah, here we are, Mike Lamb. Whoa. How much did you buy, Mike? Mike. Mike, what the? Mike Lamb was not kidding. Holy, we're gonna have to ship that with insurance. What the frick, dude? That's a lot of Pokemon. All right, guys, give me a minute. This one's kind of important. Let me get a whole box for you. All right, so we got a box. We're gonna put this on the bottom of it. Mike Lamb, you got a lot of cards to ship. All right, so we create a little nest in here. All right, now what I'd like to do Jesus Christ, man, that's a lot of Pokemon cards. What I'd like to do, wrap these up. Let's get this into a second bag as well. And bag number three. Holy Jesus Christ, dude. All right. How should I do this? I feel like it should be done like this. Oh, I've got an idea. I know how I know how to ship this. I'll be right back. I know how to ship this safely. Jesus, Mike. It's funny because I couldn't even remember that you ordered that much. All right, so what we got going on here, this is a card holder. And we'll put this box into the other box, and that will be an extremely safe way to ship. What am I doing? I am shipping a very, very expensive box to Mike. Really expensive. Okay. And you know what? Let me put some... What we're going to do, we're going to put something in there to make sure it doesn't shift around. Actually, let me grab some paper. I'm sorry, guys. This one's a kind of a very expensive item to ship. All right, so that'll keep the card stiff, right? I'm gonna put something on the other side too. All right, so that'll stop them from wiggling around and falling out of their bag. So we put this over it. I'll put one little piece of tape on it so that it doesn't pop open. Doesn't really need much. I don't think it could pop open. So we got this this box now, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna bubble wrap this, and then we're gonna put it inside of the second box, and now it's gonna be a perfectly safe package to ship. That is a lot of cards. How much do you think that box costs? Like a thousand dollars maybe? Jesus. How many cards did you open? 
All right, so this is what it looks like now. Pretty good, right? He's not giving me codes. That's right. <laughs> what? Codes. Now we got to tape it up. These are the tape sounds you were hoping to have. Loud enough, quick. Are you heading to the other room? No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> Big old dark balls, sir. DA, please. Big old dark balls. What? All right. So now we got to print you a label, Mike. Or not Mike. Um, yeah, Mike Lamb. I'm sorry. I had that right. We had just finished helping Mike Powell. Mike Lamb, you got. Uh, let's see if we can find Mike Lamb. Here's Mike Powell. What about Mike Lamb? I don't think I've ever shipped to you before, Mike Lamb. I have not. So, Mike Lamb, I need you to contact me on Discord and give me your shipping address. You guys want the live shipping? You gotta give me a message, man. I don't got your I don't got your addresses saved anywhere. All right, so I'll write Mike Lamb on the box. It's ready to go, but we gotta make a label, okay? Mike Lamb. That's a nice box. That's an expensive box, man. Is TCC looking for my claim? Okay, let's see what's happening next. Sneaky sup, one zard mystery. You got it, sneaky sup. Whoa, we get we get ever closer, guys. Sneaky sup. After sneaky, we have Tabos. One more round of darkness ablaze, then I'm broke. Tabos, you got it, mister. Time to go broke. Any word on my dark Charizard? Quentin, your dark Charizard is done graded, grading, it graded a nine. I apologize. <laughs> yeah, it came into, it didn't come in today. The grades came in today. They are on their way. The card's been shipped. The value of your dark Charizard will probably be just shy of a thousand dollars, probably be about 900, okay? So it ended up being, it ended up being a nine. <laughs> Maybe you could send it back in. I don't know. Maybe they would grade it a little nicer the next time. I don't think it has a print line. I don't think it has a print line. If we, I, if I remember when we looked at it, I'm not sure it had a print line. So whatever they're causing it to turn a nine for, maybe if you send it back in, you would have another shot for a 10. Um, but it came back a nine. Well, it hasn't come back. <laughs> I shouldn't use that language. It graded a nine. He says, wow, that's a lot of money. It is still a lot of money. Yeah, the fact that he pulled Charizard is very good. Oh, there you go. Charizard VMAX. Beautiful pull. How about that, Tabose? How about that, Tabos? Right there in the box. He was right there the whole time, guys. You were one pack away. Did you ever read that DM with my new address, says Cole. Yes, uh, I did get your message. I have not shipped your, your bag yet. I'm very close to it, though. Very close to it. Okay, what do we have here? We have Rowlet. It's our time. Very close to it. So close to this Charizard VMAX, guys. He was just right there. Thievul. And that's green. Somebody's going to cry tonight. That's right. Somebody's going to get the Charizard tonight. We're very close to that. Tabos. I have a box. Did you ship my PSA 10 Charmeleon yet? I have a box. Did you ship my Charmeleon? Uh, if you're not on the please ship list and I didn't work my way down and, and ship your box, then the answer to that question is no. All right, Tabos. Tabos is broke, he says. That Charizard has diabetes. 
Fazard night? That's right, Fazard night. I don't think we even pulled one yesterday. I think tonight we pulled one. Did we pull one yesterday? I don't remember. Te Bows. And he goes into the tea pile, huh? Oh, man, we don't have room for any more teas. TCC, cheese is picking on me. Cheese, get your butt over here. I'm just kidding. So I'm by the last three spots. Quick. To Bows. Mom. I'll turn this car around. Unexpected says five small mister going deep. Unexpected going deep. Unexpected. One, two, three, four, five. All right. There you go, unexpected. Small's almost done. Tyler H. I've got to get some decent pulls before I'm done. Two more rounds of Darkness Walls. We'll get you a fresh box so you're not pulling out the same box because the other box is almost empty and it definitely does not have a Charizard in it. Ow. He says that was my box. <laughs> yeah, you were one away. Somebody's always one away, isn't it? Aren't they? That's exactly how it works. Somebody's always one round of, of Charizards away. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Who knows? Maybe there'll be a Charizard right here. He's like, that should have been mine. <sighs> Charizard snipe. When someone snipes that Zard, just wait till we get Champion's Path and somebody snipes a secret rare out of your hands. You'll feel that one. You'll feel that one. That secret rare Zard, by the way, I swear to God, if it doesn't sell for $1,000 as a 10, I will be shocked. That, that new Secret Rare Zard, that's a thousand dollar Charizard as far as I'm concerned. People are going to whip that money out for that Zard. Easy. They're going to be like, yep, I got the money for that. Toss this over here. Here we go. That's green. That's about the third time I was one round away from several Zards. Ugh. Ugh. Let's see what we got here. Well, this will be a Charizard right now. Oh, it's a dark card. Oh, this will be a Charizard right now. No, I said I have a box because I paid for the blaze. Oh, no. No. Do you say, say sell of hold? Wait, what? Do you say sell of hold that dark? Oh, are you asking me whether you should sell it or hold it? Um, You could sell it to me for 500 but if you wanted my opinion, uh, I would hold it. I would hold it. Because PSA 9, first edition Charizard, is has moved up in price over time quite significantly. People buy it when they can't afford the 10, and a lot of people can't afford the 10. All right, here we go. We got Scissor V. Clink. Another white back. What do we got here? Wondering what place I am for my face. Collide play. Please. You're in that place. We got Arc Salt. That's a green... You're in the special place. You're in the naughty place. What do we got? Panseer. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's a green. Oh, <laughs> we got to get you a pull, mister. What the hell? Got the tuh. Oh, here we go. This will be the full art. Come on, full art. Come on, full art. Oh, my God, dude. That was straight out of a new box. That was straight out of a new box. Right there. Ten packs. The Poke Gods are not on your side tonight, Tyler. I don't know what's going on. Damn. Damn. That was a fresh box. In the words of Ricky Bobby, Bobby, if you're not first, you're last. I know. I don't know what to say, mister. Jesus. Jesus. Perplex. Ty oh, wait. You're in this one. Jesus. What is going on? You need some hits, mister. Did I put you up top? I must put you up top. I didn't put you up top. Did I? What happened to uh, Tyler H? We just had you. You should be right here. Tabos, Scott Burke, Smargs, Slytherin Dat Butt, Sky Sam2, Tyler Lambert, Toonami, Sky Blue. What the hell? Oh, here it is. Tyler Hardister. All right. Scissor Law, cut it. Sneep. God damn, Scissor. Showing up right now. Shocked Pikachu. Poppin' my cherry. Sock it to me. So, Shocked Pikachu, if you're watching right now, I need to know what you want. 
It sounds like Shock's Pikachu wants these two spots. That's what it sounds like. Because he spent an even 40. I think he wants these. But I don't know. Let's do the next thing. After, sh Is he watching? Shocked Pikachu, where you at? Super 16 says one round of Rebel Clash. Hello, Vince. What has the be been the best pull? Uh, we pulled a Charizard VMAX just like two seconds ago. Shocked Pikachu. I don't know what you want. Yes, Shocked Pikachu wants the two Zard spots, says Jessica E. Okay. Can I trust you on that, Jessica? Because I'll put him in there. I just don't want uh, don't want to spend his money wrong. Because if we play the game and he loses and he didn't want the he didn't want those rounds, he's gonna be like, wait, I want my money back. Talking to him this scored right now. Okay, very good. Can he pop in and say that? It would be good if he popped in and said it. I trust you, it's just that. I want to make sure that people are paying attention. Ricky. He has been talking about it on Discord. Sneep. Okay, that's two people saying it. We'll put him in there then. He's got those two spots. Shocked Poopy Chew. You got Champion's Path? That's right. I got Champion's Path and I'm hoarding it to myself. Ha 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 I could show it to you guys, but I won't. For reasons. So here we go. Super 16. He says, I have a box. All right, Super 16. Hatterene. Oh, another white back. Malamar VMAX. Very good. Picking up a full art. The stream is doo doo keeps freezing. That sucks. Shocked Pikachu choose mom doesn't want him to use her card. Mom! <laughs> Champion's about to take over. <laughs> Something like that. Super 16. All right. That's your bulk. Place that over there. Now, we need your bag. Scott Burke, Smarg, Sky, Sam 2, Tyler, Toonami, Sky Blue, Super 16. Shuffling you to the front. What's his name again? Shocked Pikachu? All right. Shocked Pikachu. I spell that terribly. I don't know what I'm doing over here. Somebody take my pen away. Tyler Limehouse, two rounds, Rebel Clash. I have a box. Five two packs of pendants, why not? Oh my God, people still buying the heads. This is Tyler Limehouse, ready to steal the secret rare. You ready? Five and five, cool. Ooh. That pitter powder, that beautiful pitter, pitter powder of the booster packs. Now hold on, I don't know if I have ten fates, okay? I might be I might be refunding you your money. Fates collide is sold out now, guys. Fates collide is sold out. I don't think I have ten fates collide. Because I've got to reserve some for the uh TikTokies tonight. I've got forty eight packs. To me, I hope I get it then. What? Hi TCC, what can I do, sir? I'll be looking on my next Man, the, I don't even get to read the comments. The stupid phone makes them disappear that fast. They fade. Hollow Vicavolt. You know, let's just put it like this. Green. Green. Here's a white bag. Toxtricity. Damn. He says, I bought a fate around an hour ago. Around an hour ago? Wow. That must mean that it's almost your turn then. That's crazy. What do we got? We got green. Green. White back. That's Colossal. And another white back is Sandaconda. I bought two for the Zart. Can I transfer them if they're full? Absolutely. Yes, they are transferable. All right, so Tyler Lime Limehouse picking up two V cards. Picking up the Vs. Cut something for Cheese so he will stop hating on me. Cheese has, he's got a... Uh, cutting aggression right now his, his cutting needs haven't been met so let's see tyler limehouse right it was limehouse right t lime yes and we'll jump up here because i'm pretty sure his back's gonna be up here targon's tavern here we go tyler limehouse there we go oh you got a lot just like mike lamb did Mike Lamb contact me, by the way? 
I don't know if Mike Lamb contacted me. So, after Tyler Limehouse, oh look, it's Daniel Dela Cruz. And he didn't wait an hour, he waited 36 minutes. One round of hit, or fates collide. One round of fates collide. All right. So, let's find out how many fates we actually have. You didn't wait an hour, you waited 36 minutes, which is what people are waiting. Five. Five. Oh, look at that. They're sold out anyways. So these are for the people who ordered them. I apologize, Daniel, but these are for the people who ordered them before you. This is for TikTok. Let me just check and see if I can find any other Fates Collide. So we got these two packs. Fates Collide. I'm looking for any other Fates Collide. All right, so this is what happened. This is what happened, Daniel. What happened is... The guys before you gobbled up the rest of the Fates Collide, and I didn't notice it until just now that I just had a few left. What I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and say Fates is sold out. And Daniel, why don't you pick another set or have me give you a refund? But I, I don't have any more Fates Collide. I apologize, mister. So this is going to say sold out. All right, so that's saved. We are out of Fates. Wow, we need our cards to show up in the mail already. Uh, I could put you down for $25. Daniel, I'll put you down for $25, and you can spend that anytime you want, and I'll stop the stream and take care of this, this first, okay? So you have $25, Daniel. You can spend it however you want, and I'll stop what I'm doing. You'll go, you'll go as soon as you decide what you want, you'll go next, okay? Here you go, Daniel. You'll go next, Daniel. You just got to tell me what you want. I can even do a refund if you want a refund. All right, put that up there. Fates collide. That means somebody else is not going to get their fates collide either. All right, if Daniel DLC tells me what he wants and I don't see it, somebody else help me out and tell me that he's what he said. Toonami says PSA 10, two spots, 16 and 19, four hidden fates. So Toonami, I think you're talking about this. He says, let me get this two fates. All right, two hidden fates. Two hidden fates. That would be that would be forty-two dollars. So I can't do that. I can I can do twenty-five dollars worth of cards, okay? He says, how much more? How much for five more darkness? So the two hidden fates would be forty-two dollars together, and then around a darkness ablaze, we're bringing it up to sixty-six dollars. So you have sixty-six minus twenty-five, which is forty-one dollars. You will be forty-one dollars. Do you want to do that? Because I can hold off. Uh, I'll hold off and uh, I'll take care of the next one. He meant, no, he meant the fates collide. Oh, you'll take these two fates collide. I see what you're saying. You want these two. Oh, that makes sense now. Sorry, we have hidden fates and fates collide. And then you want to substitute darkness ablaze. Well, they're not really too different in price. Darkness ablaze and fates collide. So let's just say, uh, let's just have that be the substitute and let's get them opened. All right. Technically, Darkness of Blaze is cheaper by $1, but we're talking about pennies here. If I guess you can have a dollar off something if you wanted. All right, let me go ahead and toss this to the side. Here we go. Thank you for your understanding, Daniel DLC. Let's see what you get. Come on, Hot Poles. How much I owe you for the two more? Uh, you, you don't owe me anything else. You don't owe me anything else for the two more. You're already covered. Here we go. Oh, for the additional two darkness? Uh, I wouldn't worry about it. I wouldn't worry about it. You don't got to buy them five at a time in this case. So we substituted in three darkness ablaze, and you get the two fates right there. You ready? They're roughly the same price, 24 and 25. We got delusion. Three hidden fates. I have a box. We've got ultra ball, reverse hollow. That's green. He wants them. All right, good. Familiar Bell. That's a green. Three, four. It's twelve fifty. Decidueye. And white pack. All right, let's see what we got. He wants the other two packs. In this case, if he would like to buy more Darkness Ablaze, he can pick up another five of them. We're just doing... Oh, man, and those were perfectly cold. You obviously have nothing better to do than sit on Discord in this stream all day and talk about old dumb stuff. What? What are we talking about? I know my mods aren't fighting in my live stream. So let me get you a free pack, man. All right, you're getting a free pack anyways, Daniel. Also, let me get that bulk back together. I just realized you have a bulk box. All right, so here's the free card. 
The free pack did not get you anything. It was Flaffy Swana. Now let me go back and get you all the reverse hollows here. I apologize for that. You have a you have a box. So I gave you, I tossed in the free pack. You got a total of four Darkness Ablaze packs. You got a total of four Darkness Ablaze packs, and you only paid for three. So you, you're you're good, man. The only problem is they didn't actually pull any hot cards out of them, did they? That's the only problem. All right. There you go. All right. Let's see. Let's see. What do we got? We're going to go ahead and write Daniel DLC down. Better luck on your next pulls, Daniel. Thanks for understanding that I ran out of fates. I didn't realize we were so short on fates. So back to Toonami now. Toonami wants four hidden fates. We're going to get him a fresh tin. We're going to start with that, okay, Toonami? All right, Toonamis. I'm just saying you got to have something better to do. I know you guys aren't fighting in my live stream. TCC, give me two rounds of Darkness Ablaze instead of the Face Collide. I bought two bucks to you. Sounds good, man. Pokey Rich. Damn, I'm making stocks over here. How much for a tin? Oh, the tins are so cheap. They're so cheap. It's like $5 a tin. Here we go. Ah, uh, there, there was a time when the tins were $8. $8 tins. Unbelievable. All right, here we go. Watch the last darkness that the wanted had the VMAX art. TCC, give me two rounds of darkness ablaze instead of the face collide. What? All right, here we go. Kmart's here went out of business long ago. Oh, beautiful. Decidueye full art. And this is why people like to open up hidden fates, because these sexy guys pop out. Sexy schmexy Decidueye. Did Toonami say he had a box? I don't think he has a box. No, I don't think he does. Okay, here we go. Next pack. That was pack number one. He's got three more packs. Let's see if he can hit another hot card. We have Reverse Hollow Psychic Energy. Ooh. Next pack. Snorlax. Mr. TCC noticed me, Senpai. What's up, your boy Russ? How's it going, man? You just got to add more wings and more nudges, and then I'll notice. DNC, uh, shiny, shiny, not secret rare. All right, so the tin's all right. It had a full art. It had a shiny. Uh, the reverse hollow sidekick's okay. Okay, so we'll toss this up here. Decidueye. Toonami. Toonami should have a bag. Toonami. Beautiful. All right, very nice. Now, there's only one spot left for the Charizard VMAX. Here's what I'm going to do. Because he wanted two spots, and I'm not going to have another round of this. I'm going to add a spot, but I'm also going to add a simple price. Okay, so I'm going to add a simple price. Toonami. So basically, the bonus prize will be a spot in the base two mystery, okay? That's what will happen. So the $20, it'll go straight into having a second reward, okay? So you guys don't have to feel disgruntled. I know you guys are going to be like, no! But it's all, really, it's just one additional spot. It doesn't actually play a big difference in your odds of winning. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27... 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. All right, get nervous. Get nervous. Somebody's going to get the Charizard. There's going to be an additional prize for one spot in the base two mystery. Get nervous. You know what's crazy? This guy's 600. The, the game we did before this with the three base starters was actually much more expensive at like 750. One base. All right, so these are the two prizes. This is for the Zard. This is for a spot in the base two mystery. I'm I'm sweating, mainly because I'm fat, but also because I'm nervous. <laughs> All right, guys, here we go. <laughs> also because I'm nervous. Here we go. All right. 
So we're going to shuffle it real well, right? Real good shuffling. No funny business at all. I'm not going to rig it and immediately give it to Jesse E. Imagine if I sharp won. I sharp, if you won this, you will have made like $2,000. Easily. I mean, he has the same odds as you guys. Who has who has better odds? Toonami, who went real deep. He's got four spots. Who else? Shocked Pikachu has two spots. Mr. TCC, throw me in the small again, sir. Put the two of them together. Please wink, wink, nudge. He knows like nobody else. <laughs> you in the small sounds good, Russ. All right, here we go. Supreme got two as well. Landing on 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. Here we go, Bullet City. No, it's Bull City. He could win on one. Let's see what happens. No luck. Subby on two, Jesse on three. Irvin on four, zero zero on five, Irvin C on six, sent you my address. Thank you very much. We'll do that right after this. What were we on? One, two, three, four, five, six. So we're on seven. Seven is Supreme. Eight is Rudy. Nine is Tabose. Ten is Maddie M. Maddie M. Now, is it going to be the Charizard or is it going to be the Electrode? Is it going to be the uh, base set? Are you nervous, Maddie M? <laughs> oh, it's the one spot in the base set. It's not over yet, guys. Oh, that's interesting. That made the that made the game way more dramatic right there. So here you go, Maddie. The nice thing, Maddie, is that you keep your money. It's, it's in a new game now. You'll see. Maybe you'll win the base set pack. Who knows? Right? So, Maddie, <laughs> that was very fun, the dr dramatic moment. I I'll have to remember that. So, Maddie, um, Titanic. Number 12 is Red Flare. Number 13 is Tyler Lamp. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Tyler Lamb, uh, Lam Lambert. I was going to say Lamb House. That's the Charizard. Tyler Lamb on 13's the winner. Congratulations, Tyler Lamb. Congratulations, Tyler Lamb. Woo. Tyler Lamb. Oh, my. Oh, my. Tyler Lamb gets the beautiful Charizard V Max. Woo! Beautiful. There it is. Brand new, freshly graded. Oh, man. Red Flare was one away. <laughs> he says, I'm going to quit. Look at that. PSA 10. Let's get that name. Tyler. I write Limehouse on the back and ship it to the wrong person. Lambert. <laughs> All right. Wow, that was really dramatic. Adding, I noticed adding Maddie Merck, um, and not, not Maddie Merck, adding the second card made it so dramatic because when you get the card pulled, it could be the you know the Charizard or it could just be a simple twenty dollars spot in the base set mystery. The the huge difference in the value of the prizes made it very exciting. Yeah, we might have to do that again for the future because that was that was amazing. <laughs> wow, that uh, that went surprisingly fast. That didn't take any time at all. Let's see what's next. Wow, 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 we wow. Carlos Madrigal, one. Oh, let's take care of Mike Lamb now, right? So Mike Lamb has been waiting to get shipped. Let's create his label. You know what? I'll leave this up on the table. Hold on. Let's leave it up on the table. Here you go, Mike Lamb. Let's leave it up on the table so you can stare at it and you guys can feel jelly about it and stuff. Fatty Czar did just go. Yes. All right. Mike Powell. Mike Powell. Oh, not Mike Powell. We're looking for the other guy. Here it is. So, Michael Lamb, you're in Canada. Oh, that changes things. Michael Lamb, we got to get you special shipping. Hold on. That makes it complicated. So hold on. Let me let me see. How much does this weigh? This feels like it weighs about two pounds. 
Oh, so give me a second, Michael. Michael, I'm gonna. The first step is I got to get you a little form, okay? It's a simple form. You're gonna fill this out, okay, Michael? So we're not done yet. You're actually gonna owe me a little bit of money because you have some heavy stuff to ship, and it's international. Two pounds is. Ex it's not like super expensive, but it's gonna cost you a little bit. So I I just sent you a form. Fill that form out, and then I'll start filling out the label. And we need to find out how much this costs. It might be $23 to ship it if I ship it a certain way. I'm trying to think, what's the other way to ship it? You have, I think you'll have two options. You'll have a $23 option and you'll have a $55 option. All right, so I'll get back to you on that, Mike. Let's get to the next person. I can see you're filling it out, so we won't make you wait too long. I didn't realize you were Canadian. So, Carlos says, one darkness ablaze and I have a bag. You got it, Carlos. Can we go ahead and live to my Zard, please? Yes. I just sent my address. Sounds Thanks, good. Mister. Sounds good. He wants that Charizard ship ASAP. Oops. God damn it. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I got cards spilling out. The booster box tipped over on the floor. And all the packs, like, slid out of it, of course. Let's get these for Carlos. After this, we'll help... Michael, once again, with printing that label for his very expensive box. Sneep. Sneep. All right. What do we got? So Carlos says he has a bag. We've got Butterfree V. Man, that Charizard V Max. So schmexy. Who are you trying to race? What? Ooh, Senna Scorch. Full art. Beautiful. All right. You already have a good set of five packs. Let's see what else you get. You got a V card and a full art, huh? Thanks for the new Pokemojis. You like Spank? I'm a big fan of Spank. Should you get Shiny's Art Express graded? That's a great question. That's a, that's a difficult to answer question. If you're impatient, yes. If you're not impatient, I don't think his price is going to necessarily go down. So, although maybe it could. With the new Champion's Path Charizard coming out, maybe people will slow down on buying Hidden Fate Swords. That's a good question. I don't know. All right, all right, Carlos, you did well. You did well. Carlos, you'll be in here. Oh, God. These Rebel Clash packs, they shouldn't even be here. I'll pull from those as... All right, well, anyways, let's get this, Carlos. <laughs> Christian Moss. Cheese. Carlos Madrigal. What's the next medium? Uh, the next medium... Oh, we don't have any Fates Collide. Well, I can still put you down for Fates Collide for the future if you want. Sounds good. All right. Oops. Can I ship you some of my cards so you can send them to PSA? Yeah, you could do that. Some, If you do that, just remember, if the card gets lost, it's not my fault. Also, when the card arrives, uh, I'm probably not going to open it right away. It just depends on how much I'm doing that day, okay? So you got to be patient. What are the spots looking like? They're looking pretty spotty. All right, so Carlos is done. We're going to jump back to Mike Lamb. So he's Canadian. We're going to we're gonna fill out a Canadian label, and that always takes a little longer. Here we go. Jump up here. International label, huh? All right. It always takes a little longer to fill one of these out. All right. Let's get this. Mike Lamb, I'm scared of how much it's going to cost to ship it, okay? Uh, so, Mike Lamb, I think I understand it, actually. Let's do this. Toronto's the city, I think. Mike Lamb, the reason I say number five city, number six state, is because I don't actually, as an American, I don't know the difference between those two things. So that's why you're supposed to fill the form out in that way. But that's okay, because I think Ontario's the state. Just the fact that it's got the abbreviation. All right, and that's... The postal code, that part's easy. We're going to say Canada. 
There we go. Canada. All right. You know what's crazy with the international shipments, guys? I actually have to have their phone number. Isn't that crazy? You're not allowed to ship it unless they, you provide a phone number. Okay. We're very close. Let's go ahead and pick something out. So the package has to be length, width, and height cannot exceed 36 inches. Length, length cannot exceed 24 inches. I think we're good. I think that'll be okay. So let's just say it's one pound. All right, Mike. So it'll be $23 to ship this, okay? It'll be $23 shipping, okay, Mike? I'll go ahead and print the label because I'm, I'm sure you'll cover that. Let me go and choose what to ship this as. I'll claim that it has a value of about $20. All right, there it goes. All right, Mike, so to get that shipped, did you already pay for shipping? Let me see. It doesn't say that you've already paid for shipping. Paying for the shipping, Mike. Perfect. All right, and your box is all ready to go. It's packed real careful, so your cards are nice and safe. You got a lot of valuable cards in there. I'm sure you'll have fun when it arrives. All that has to happen now is the mailman picks it up, and he picks it up tomorrow. Cool. So we're done with Mike Lim. We helped Carlos. Who's next? Shocked Pikachu. I gave you 40 for two spots on the Zard. Not sure how it works. Hydrogen Bromide says, Hibben Fates, baby. All right, Hibben... Hibben Fates for Hydrogen Bromide. All right, here we go. Sneep. Live shipping, I have a bag of box and a PSA 10 card, sir. Oh, people are all into the live shipping at the moment. Here it goes. No problem, Mike. No problem. Thank you. You opened a lot of cards, which was probably very entertaining. What is it to get the Shiny Zard Express graded? I think it's like 140 is the price I put down. Ooh, Buzzwool, look at that, Buzzwool. You're wanting to send your Shiny Zard out for Express grading? I can do that for 140. You'll be back during paths. Heck yeah, if I have any left, I'm gonna open them all myself, right? Hydrogen bromide. No, I'm kidding, I'm sure I'll have some. I'm sure I'll have plenty for you guys. I'll have so much that you guys won't be able to open them all. I sharp, Irvin, Gantu, Hydrogen Bromide. Really? I cannot find you. Hmm. Maybe we recently shipped you. We must have re <coughs> we must have recently shipped you. I just shipped no bag, so you have no bag, but you sent me on a goose chase anyways. I see how it is. Gotta head to bed. Alright, what's the turnaround time for express grading? Uh it's about it's about one week, but uh, I think it feels more like two weeks because of, of shipping. But yeah, it's about one week. I, I would call it two weeks. It's extremely fast. It's extremely fast. That's how we got this guy so fast, by the way. I used express grade, express grading. It was very expensive, but also, uh, you know, I've sold it in a very short amount of time. So, you know, there's ups and downsides to it. it it's actually pretty nice. It's pretty nice not having to wait. You, you basically, it's like, it's like paying the, uh, hydrogen bromide. It's like paying the fast pass over here. It's expensive, but it's like, you don't have to wait. And in the case of PSA, it's like skipping months of waiting, literally. Louis Rivero, one spot for Charizard VMAX. Louis, uh, we do not have spots for Charizard VMAX anymore. I can put you into the large. So over here, here's the large, by the way, guys, for those who didn't catch it, is Blastoise Piplup. And there's 24 spots, 25 actually, Gerard got a free spot. There's 25 spots for Blastoise Piplup PSA 10. It's a really cute card. If you're into Blastoise, you might want this card. It's from Cosmic Eclipse. The price is based off of what it goes for online. And what's the next best fast grading, says iSharp. The next best one, uh, the next best one takes like, um, I think they have it like minimum two months 
and is pretty expensive. I can't remember. Blastoise Piplup. Hey, mister, I did the live shipping and missed the Zard, so can I get the live shipping now? Oh, right. Yes. Yes. Who is it I'm trying to help? I'm trying to help Louis Rivera. All right, he's not answering. He's just going to go on a card. Mom, TCC used the wrong Uranus title. <laughs> did I really? <laughs> Usually I'm pretty good with that. Largest fine, says Louis. All right, there we go. So this is the next one, by the way, guys. And we're going to say Louis. So, Louis, you got seven and eight, okay? Number eight, number 24, number 10, small. And uh, we'll set this one here for now. Red Flare says he wants to be shipped. Is that right? Shipping for Red Flare, huh? You think it's so easy to get shipped. You think you just click a button and, and, I, and I dance like a puppet. So let's see, Red Flare. Perplex, Pokey Dev, Quentin, Ray Diz, Pitiful Anonymous, Ruse, Raoma, Raul, Peter Kizzy, Ray Dizzy, Professional Diglett. Okay, interesting. What do you have, mister? We have Patterns, Rizak, Pingus. Is it that you just have PSA cards? Maybe you just have PSA cards. Red Flare. I'm not the devil, but I made a deal with him once. I have Charizard, says Ray, Red Flare. Okay. Charizard PSA, or... I don't know what you mean by that. He says three Charizards. Okay. He's got three Charizards. Are you saying you have a bag, or are you saying you have PSA cards? What's up, Ashton? Ah, he says I have a bag. Okay, I gotcha. One spot in the large case. You have a bag with three Charizards in it. Hold on, let me fix these real fast. There we go. Okay, let's grab the R, R box. The R box, Pokemon. Rudy, Russ, Power Up, Perplex, Pokedev, Quinton, Ray Diz, Pitiful Anonymous, Ruse, Ryoma, Raul, Peter Kizzy, Ray Diz, Tiny Trader. What? So you're not here, mister. Is it possible, Red Flare, that you already shipped? I, I think Red Flare, you might have already shipped, man. I'm not seeing any cards for you here. I think it's possible I already shipped you because I remember you requesting shipping a few times. Unless I put you on like the sidebar. Did you have like a really big, thick bag? I don't think you did. I think you had like a a bag with some nice cards in it. Let's see. Dustin Jones. Uh, Joe, Joe Diana. He needs to be shipped. Oh, here's Cole. Nice. I needed to get this guy out anyways. There's Cole. All right. He says, nah, it was decent sized. So it might have already been shipped to you then. Might have already been shipped. How about that? Because if it was decent sized, we would not have any trouble finding it. And it's not in the R box. He says, this is the giveaway ripping packs. So I got I to gotta ship this back to the one guy. Where, where can I put this where I won't? I don't want to put this in the wrong spot. Let's place it here for now. There we go. He says, okay. He's JMO says, what's the small... You should, if, if you sent me an email, you should have tracking numbers. Go check those tracking numbers real fast. You probably have it on the way. Does the small go off yet? Uh, yes. The No, the small did not go off. It's very close. You know, I've got some packages outside. Uh, give me a second, guys. I'm going to bring them in for the night. I'll be right back. I got some packages outside. I should have brought these in time. What are you up to? I wish I could show you guys the volume of cards that we ship. Okay. So, 
The last thing we did was Red Flare wanted live shipping, but he didn't actually have any cards for me to ship. And then we go on to JMO. Two for the fat Zard. So JMO, what would you like, JMO? JMO, we don't have fat Zard anymore. I can put you on the Blastoise. You want me to put you on the Blastoise? Oh, Blastoise. JMO, where's JMO? Where's JMO? All right, we're going to go ahead and give JMO a card. What's the medium and small look like? Oh, man. I hate answering that question. It's the worst question. So here's the small. Here's the medium. All right, so now you guys know. What can I do for you? Small, all right. JMO, JMO. Who's next? After JMO, we have Maddie Merck. Live shipping? Live shipping for Maddie Merck. Wait, what does he say he has? Two bags and some two PSA cards that I won. Ah, Maddie Merck's got some PSA cards. Maddie Merck, right? Yeah, Maddie Merck. Sweet. Two PSAs, you say. Let's go find his PSAs. Tyler, Gronk, Targon, Russ, Scott, Beardy Man. I got a ton of PSA cards. What do we got here? Moist Man. Who the heck is Moist Man? Matty Merck, that's one. Another Russ card, what? Russ, you got PSA cards over here? What the heck? Alex, Tyler, Rudy, Gene. Moist Man again. Who's Moist Man? Ninja Bread. <laughs> oh man. All right, what do we got here? Beardy. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, it was the very, very, very last card. <laughs> I had to search literally every card in the, all the piles to find the last one. That's funny. All right, you got, oh man, you won the Sabrina's Gengar 9. Nice, dude. I didn't know that. So that was one of the large. And Giovanni Machamp 10. Those are really nice. Okay, cool. Here is the remainder for Hidden Fates Pass. Charizard in my dreams, A. Eh? Charizard in my dreams? All right. Butterfree. I help me out, chat. Who is chat? He says, I have another bag. Another bag? You got two bags? All right, one, two, three, four. Well, if you got another bag, I probably shouldn't be doing this. You need a way to show the small, medium, and large. All right, we'll toss this over here. It's probably just not gonna happen. I don't see an easy way to implement that because they're constantly changing. I don't have a second camera and I don't wanna update the information in the uh, description each time. Miguel, Maddie Merck. You're so right, Maddie Merck. Maddie Merck, second bag. All right. What do we got in here? Got a little round of common commons. Cool. What's in the large? Blastoise Piplup. Blastoise Piplup PSA 10. It's the alternative art from Cosmic Eclipse. Very cute card. All right. Maddie Merck getting a live shipping. Maddie Merck, message me on Discord with your address right away, if you don't mind. When you guys ask for live shipping, be sure you give me your address on Discord. Guess I'm out of tape. Gotta change my tape roll. 
Give me a second. I'm changing my tape roll. Ah, that's annoying, man. I wish I had the tape rolls over here. I try to keep the stream moving, the line moving fast, but it's so hard, man. It's really difficult. Okay. Cool. Now, let's get this into a bag. Once again, Maddie Merck, be sure you message me right away with your with your address. Hi, mister. Too, large, please. too small, too large. You guys sure like the custom boosters. Here it is, Merc. Looks like you did send it. Very nice, man. All right. Give me a second. Let me start putting your address together on a fresh label. And let me go ahead and get your email. Maddie, is that a guy's name or a girl's name? Sounds like a guy's name, but I'm not sure. All right. The label's printed and your cards are on the way. Very good. There's no gender. Who's next? <clears throat> After Maddie Merck, we have Rudy Tav. Big old dark balls. All right. All right. Rudy Tav's going deep on the darkness of balls. You got any darkness of balls? Not your bud, pal. <laughs> I'm not your buddy, guy. You guys can ask for certain spots in the games, but in the end, if it's already filled, I'm just going to put you anywhere. Also... Uh, you know, if people don't claim a number, I'm just going to immediately fill maybe like the most recent spot. You know, it'll just be my choice. How many hidden face packs does he have left? I do have enough for you to go deep. Wait, Mike Lim. He was the guy going super deep on hidden fates, right? Mike Lim. Oh, man. My memory is so bad. Rudy Tav has a box, does not. Rudy Tav. Does Rudy Tav have a box? I'm, I'm looking behind me. Well, he didn't say he has a box. I can't remember. Rudy Tav. He went super deep on the hidden fates, didn't he? Admiral Tuesday says, I do. Three, four. Ooh, Tauros. Wait, he said I do. Oh, my God. <laughs> Here we go, Charizard. Swizzy, what's up, Swizzy? Welcome to Poke Emojis. That means we need 21 new members for the next emojis to get unlocked. Green. Did you see the new Zards? I did see the new Zards. How nice are those? I don't know about the Shining Zard. He definitely doesn't look as good as the Hidden Fates Shining Charizard. But the Champion's Path Charizard looks pretty clean. I think that'll be the one that everyone wants. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, my claim was going really deep. That was really crazy. I remember that now. I have a short memory, so you guys have to help me out. Rudy Tav. Second account here. I subbed on LOL. Had to match my Streamlabs name. <laughs> Very crazy. <laughs> All right, Rudy. Rudy Tav. Let me buy all your packs so you can't pull any. What? <laughs> what? So... I have a box. Did you ship my PSA 10 Charmeleon yet? 
Uh, I very likely did not. Tyler Hardister says, two more packs of Hibben. Why not? Oh, no. Oh, no. I hope you get good pulls. <laughs> it's a lady Charizard. <laughs> Maybe that's what it is. <laughs> Champion's Pathway, the set everyone wants. Because it's going to have Tart Heart in it. No body shaming is hard. Dude, he looks like a kid drew him, doesn't he? The, uh... The shining one. I, I, maybe it's just me. It does not look attractive. Maybe it's just me. That is not attractive. The the look that they did with for that Charizard. The shining Zard is still going to be worth at least two hundred. He'll be worth a bunch of money. I don't know. It's too many Zards. There's kind of like some Charizard inflation going on. If you ask me, think about that, guys. Charizard inflation. Sorry about that. Let's see if this had anything in it. Charizard inflation. Perfectly cold. Now I'm going to open the top two for me. I'm just kidding. Looks like Twilight version of Charizard. Woo! Loving them hibs. Loving them hibs. Who's next? <laughs> Unexpected. Ten face collide. Last pull for the night. Let's get me some luck tonight, mister. So I believe Unexpected told me to open up two rounds of darkness instead. Is that right? You still here, Onyx? Five, four... Five. Can we do the fossil break now, please? <laughs> I know, right? No, we're, we're going through base set. Base set two. Hey, mister, were those mine? Yes, they were. Those two hibs were yours. All right, two bucks for me. Oh, you're too generous. Here it goes. You know, with that generosity, it's almost guaranteed you get a secret rare. He says, dang, I wanted to change the darkness of balls. Oh, I'm so sorry, mister. I did not realize that. I did not realize that. I would have happily have done that for you. Um, damn. That might have been a situation where maybe shoot me like a $2 super chat or maybe like a message. Did you send me a message? Maybe you sent me a message and I didn't even hear it. I'm sorry, mister. I apologize. Let's go ahead and throw this over here. Let's see what we got. Darkness of balls. Yeah, the hidden fates are crazy. What do we got? We've got Larvitar and Hoopa. Let's see what you missed out on. Let's see. Let me fix this. Give me a second. He says it's okay. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. I have to I have to do what Streamlabs says. And that was what was on the Streamlabs. I apologize, man. That's a good question, though. I wish there was... Uh, it would be interesting if there was a way for you to retract an opening. But uh, in this case, you didn't... You weren't... Uh, my, my attention basically wasn't caught... And so I did not know that you wanted to change it. Flygon. Russ says what? My package says it's in Earth City. Oh, that's where I used to work at UPS. That's the distribution center. Remember, we were talking about that last night, guys. No, we were talking about that yesterday on Discord. I used to work at Earth City UPS Distribution Center. I worked there for about half a year. It wasn't very long at all. It might not have even been a full half year. But, uh, yeah, it was really terrible to work there. I said it here. That's all. It's my fault. All right. No problem, mister. Yeah, I apologize again. It wouldn't have been such a bad ending if there weren't freaking cold packs. Cold packs, man. Cold packs. Would have been better if they were hot. Hot. Hot packs. Three, four. Furret and a full art crowbat. Okay, Vicavolt crowbat. What else we got? That's green. This 3D version of Crobat is kind of a boring look, isn't it? I like some of the artwork that we see for Crobat coming out of, uh, coming out of, like, Neo Destiny, for example. <coughs> Excuse me. Mamacita, that's right. I got a little bit of a cough. Don't worry, it's just a little bit of COVID. This is going to be the polls for... Who was these for? These for? These were for... Unexpected. These were for Unexpected. Ah, Crobat and Vickerful. That's not Charizard. Where's the Charizard? Unexpected. Did you already have a bag, Unexpected? Yes, you did. You had a double bag. What if I had, like, the perfect memory? You know, can we just take this out and add it to the other one entirely? Make this simpler. There we go. COVID coffin on the peeps cards? That's right. 
Now, Ruse, what's up, man? He says he wants a round of Darkness Ablaze. Can I just get this box closer to me? Why has it got to be so far away? I'm, like, leaning way back to pull from here. Here we go, Ruse. You ready? Too many packs. I'll best the UPS person who hurt you. Spank, spank. Oh, no. He did not just say spank, spank. <laughs> Sneep. The UPS person who hurt you. Shipping out the COVID with the cards. COVID is free of charge. <laughs> you got to get your COVID immunity by catching the illness first. Three, four. We got Grimmel Snarl. Who's this for again? Ruse. All right, Ruse. Good luck. Grimmel Snarl. Already off to a good start. What's up, OP, OP Breloom? What's up, man? <clears throat> we got Flaffy. No, please, I don't want six. It's stroke, stroke. <laughs> what? Getting down with the sickness? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I've been coughing for a few days. Powerful energy. You know, actually, it would concern me if it wasn't COVID. I wonder what it would be. Green? I can't serve my country. Don't want COVID. <laughs> what? <laughs> Stupid fly. Grimmel Snarl VMAX is going to be your hot pull. That's not bad. Five packs, one full art. The most you can hope for, almost. Ruse? Ruse, where are you at? I know you're back here, Ruse. Here we are. Ruse! Grape! That's grape! I should wear gloves. All right. Tyler Limehouse, three hibs, I have a box. All right, Tyler Limehouse, going deep. Three hibs. Give me a second. The flu or the cold? Mr. TCC, remember that season is right around the coast corner flu season what's up arvon yeah we're gonna have a lot of people dying from the flu and from covid it's, it's really sad you know shows you how much humans have not mastered their environment you know still dying from all these simple diseases can't wait to get my psa graded charizards back heck yeah tonight i'm probably going to finish the submissions that's probably what i'm going to do tonight the problem is I have a really big one I want to send out for myself, and I want to include that in the outgoing box. What's happening here? What's up, man? We're opening up Pokemon cards. Pokemon. Two rounds of darkness ablaze. I have a bag. All right, here we go, Tyler. Oh, man, picking up the Full Art Sil Valley. Beautiful. What's next? All right, that's cold. Last pack. Tapu Coco. Damn, dude. That was a hot tinny. Jesus. That was definitely worth it. Picking up an easy Tapu Coco. Damn. That makes that an easy 10. All right, there we go. Tyler Lime. Easy 10. Tapu Poo Poo. Looking off center on the back, probably a nine. Looking off center in exactly the same way, but like in reverse. Hmm. So I think you have two nines, actually. Well, you definitely get your money back, because even as a nine, I'm pretty sure these will probably have a chance of selling for a decent margin. These look like nines. Let me go ahead and put them into your bag. Tyler Limehouse, huh? Gosh, too bad that the Coco wasn't a ten. Tap of Cocos. He looks like a 9. Maybe he will get a 10. Maybe not. Your boy Russ, throw me in the small again. All right. I will sacrifice my own life for Pakistan. Russ. Tabos, can we go ahead and live ship my Zard? I just sent my address. Thanks. All right. This is Tabos. No, that's Tyler Lambert. Can we go ahead and please ship my Zard? Oh, I know, I know what you're talking about, Ben. You must have won him over here. Here it is. I could send it in a white... I send this in a white envelope with a stamp. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That would never happen. That would never happen. Do you have any Evo packs? I do not. <clears throat> Pretty soon I will. Actually, let me think about it. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think I have some in storage. 
I have some in storage and I have some on the way. Why don't I just use the ones in storage and then replace them with the ones that are on the way? Hmm. Maybe I do have some. All right, Tabo's. Give me a minute. <clears throat> trying to clear my throat here. What the heck? What the heck? I might have XY Evolutions because I didn't think about that before. I could just take them out of storage and then replace the ones that were in storage. Like borrowing from myself. TCC, can you confirm an e-check for me? Bob, you always have an e-check. All right, so lots of protection. Tabo's wants that Charizard ASAP. All right, I'm jumping over here. Need a drink, Ruse, Peruvian, Bows. This must be you. Okay. Alan, if you want me to ship your, if you want me to get you uh, a tracking number in the future, you're going to need an email address, okay? Go ahead and clear this. There we go. Very good. Is it is it Quip's turn to open cards? I wonder if it's Quip's turn. No. Not tonight. <laughs> You're like, no. <laughs> That's okay. You've been working all day anyways. Let's see what's next. So, to Bose, you have your Charizard on the way. Tyler Lambert says, let's live ship. I put what I have in the ship list this morning. Don't forget... Ty oh, that's Tyler Lambert. That's also a really big one. Um, I might be able to get it done. He says, let's live ship. I put what I have in the ship list this morning. Mm. Okay. Give me a minute. I noticed that when it comes to live shipping, shipping someone's bag is actually very fast. It takes like a minute. Shipping a whole box, it, it takes a long time. Two sets of Evo in storage if you have them. I decay how much they cost, but let me know if I shorted you. All right. Thanks, mister. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and get yours done, Tyler Lambert. Let's get this done. I gotta have a better system for this. I feel like these little bags fall apart. Two rounds of darkness, a blaze. I have a box. You have a box? You're not allowed to have that. Give that back. All right, Tyler. Tyler, wait. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Let me toss this to the side real fast. There we go. All right, so that's fine. So you should have some on the table too, right? Because you've been opening tonight. Let me see if I can find some more bulk for you in, on the table here. Rudy Tav, Super 16, Brian, Daniel DLC, Asian Tim, Tyler Lime, Rudy Tav, Super 16, Tyler Lime, Tyler Lime. Tyler Lime, you've been going deep. Something tells me you're going to get the Pokey Ridge roll. Oh, maybe you haven't got any bulk on the table. Okay. And now my bulk table, or my bulk piles are all messed up. That's annoying. That's annoying. Okay, Tyler Lambert, you should have a nice bag. Let's find a nice bag for you. Tyler Lambert, can you tell me if you have PSA cards? I believe you do. I'm sorry, guys. This, this does take a while. We might have to change the live shipping for people who have bulk boxes so that if you have a bulk box, uh, it, it, t it costs more. Because sh live shipping a bulk box is uh, expensive. Time-wise, it's very expensive. I was not here for it, but I paid for live shipping of everything. What? Please let me know I have a box in the bag. Tyler Limehouse is here. Why would Tyler Lambert not be here? Is he on a sidebar, perhaps? 
Super T, Tyler Hardister, Scott Burke, Smarg, Slytherin, Sky, Tyler Lambert. Okay, we got one bag for Tyler Lambert. Let's see. Saul Shigoya, Tyler Eller, Casey Anderson, Opie Breloom, Sean Miller, Dustin Jones. Really? Just want my stuff? <laughs> no problem. <laughs> so, does this look right, Tyler Lambert? This is the bag I have for you. Check out the bag I have for you. We got Piers, Mew, Charizard, Butterfree, Rose, Grimmel Snarl, Slowbro, Vicavolt, Rhyperior, Scissor, Senescorch, Salamence, Mew, Crobat, and Scissor V. Does that look right? Just want to make sure I got it all. I think I did. Let me go get the PSA cards as well, in case you have those. I'm pretty sure you have them. Yeah, PSA cards. All right, here we go. PSA card for Tyler Lambert. We got one. Christian Moss. Who the heck's a Christian Moss? How do I become a member on YouTube? How do you become a member on YouTube? Here we go, Tyler Lambert. Tyler Lambert. Pterodactyl, Como O, Killjoltz, Dustin Jones, Sky Bluebird. Okay, how about this right here? Alex Rod, Tyler Lambert. Wow, you played that a lot, man. I didn't realize you got so much. Andy Dell. Okay, places over here. Dustin Jones, Russ, Christian Moss, I think that's going to be it. Okay, cool. So those are your PSA cards. PSA cards for two for me plus bulk box. Yeah, I've got your bulk box. So here we go. You got Mewtwo, Centret, Jolteon, and Flareon. Tyler Lambert. these guys let me go ahead and uh, wrap these up together I know guys this is taking a long time we, we might have to uh, we might have to create a rule about live shipping when it comes to bulk boxes because the bulk boxes really do take much longer than than let's say like a regular envelope all right This is here. So let's get this book box up here. These are probably going to shift around unless I put a lot of padding on them. Place that right there on the side. All right, now I just need stuffing. Here we go. Oops. Oops. How do you get the pokey emojis? I don't know. How does he get the pokey emojis? Doesn't Tyler Lambert have the pet? Oh, <laughs> the Charizard, of course. <laughs> we'll ship them separately. Yeah, we'll ship. Uh, 
We will ship them separately. It'd just be a little more. Well, this will arrive first, though. All right, I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, he, he won that. Let me just cut this back open. That sucks. Let me just cut this back open. You'll, you'll want it to arrive in this box because this box will actually ship priority, and that's faster. You don't want first class. You want priority. All right, we're popping this back open. God damn it. <laughs> How did that happen? Well, let's see. I got this bubble wrap. I'll put him in the bubble wrap. He says, sorry, I'm so much trouble. Right, so let's see. Book boxes take too long, I'm thinking. We might change it so that if you want to do a bulk box, it's going to be like double price or something. All right. Woo! Oh, man. That's exhausting. That's exhausting. Let's go grab his address. I don't know what you go by. So I got a bunch of people here who sent me a message, but everyone's got a different name. Let's check Need a Drink. All right, it's not Need a Drink. Let's check uh, Peruvian. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, let's check Lucas. Louie, it's Louie. Let me, I think actually I can mark this as unread. So Tyler Lambert, could you do me a favor and send me your address? Let's see if you, let me see if I can just, oh, I can find you. Okay, very good. I can search you. Hey, there it is. All right, I got your address. We're good. Woo! This is like running the Olympics over here. I'm on a marathon. I'm on a Poke card, a Poke card marathon. Of course, with the rate that I miss your cards, it might be the Special Olympics, right? It's a special marathon. <laughs> All right, the label's created. Yeah, you want it to be shipped priority because then it'll ship really fast. Priority is like two day, three day shipping, depending on where you are at. Whereas first class can be much slower. It can take like a whole week. All right, there we go. You know, it's weird. UPS would actually get whole trucks full of uh, priority mail. Sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes. All right, that's done. Yeah, that must have taken us, what, about 20 minutes? We can't have that. We're definitely going to change the rules on that. I'm learning. I'm learning the things that slow the live stream down. That definitely slows it down. That was way too long. It's about 20 minutes. Felt like it. Okay, we're done with Tyler Limehouse, or Lambert. And now we have Mike Lamb, who's been waiting for 42 minutes, but he was just paying for shipping. Thank you so much, Mike Lamb. You're the man. Rudy Tav, live shipping. I have a bag and a PSA 10 card. <laughs> oh, man. So Rudy Tav would like some live shipping as well. Everyone wants live shipping at the same time. Don't worry, guys. We'll be back to opening up cards in a minute. This is going to be a shipping stream in a minute. Yeah, look at that. We actually lost... We lost 100 viewers, I think. He says box also. For Rudy Tab? All right, Rudy Tab, you're on hold right now. We'll, we'll go back to you. Rudy Tab, you're on hold. We're going to open up more cards, okay? One small, one large. What is a Pokemon fan's favorite place to go in France? Paris. Paris? Poke Kobe, 8, 24, and 10 on the small. Poke Kobe, you'll get 36 and 37. <laughs> One small, one large. What is a Pokemon fan's favorite place to go in France? Paris. All right. So we finished that up. Pokekobe, let's get it started. All right. For the small, we have 
Inkei, Dark Golbat, Dark Vaporeon, Mega Sableye, and Raichu. He says, I paid extra. Oh, thank you so much, mister. But what's going to happen is we're probably going to change the rules on bulk shipping in a minute here. Uh, I apologize. It, we're not going to skip you. I'm, I'm going to I'm going to continue the live stream. People aren't here to watch me ship cards for 30 minutes. Uh, so we have to have some rules about that. We just finished doing the guy before you. It was Lambert. And it took him like, it took me to about 15 minutes, I would say, to get him done. So we'll come back to you, Rudy. Do not worry. We'll still get you shipped in this live stream. But first, we're going to... First, we're going to keep enjoying some other stuff because people don't want to watch it 30 minutes of shipping. That's just boring. We can't be boring. That's the number one rule for a live stream. You can't be boring. That's not allowed. So let's keep going. Let's keep going. Number one rule, you cannot be boring in a live stream. That's the number one rule. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. We're playing the small, guys. Could you refund me that second one? It double charged me. Sorry. I heard that, Ardenan. Yeah, I heard that. Yeah, we'll refund you. Oh, my show paused. Let me unpause my show. So we're going to say one base. We're going to say Golbat. We're going to say Vaporeon, Vap. We're going to say Tyranitar. Speaking of Vap, we're going to say Raichu. Did we get Inke? Oh, we didn't get Inke. <laughs> we're going to get Inke. What do you guys think of that cancel Netflix trending on Twitter? Did you guys hear about that? Did you guys hear about that? Trending on Netflix, cancel, or trending on Twitter, cancel Netflix. It was a, it's a bipartisan moment where both people on the left and the right uh, kind of agree on something. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. Thirty-one. Let's see what else we need. We, we're going up to thirty-nine. 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. Netflix stocks already dropped 20% today because it was the number one trending topic on Netflix. So what happened is they released, there it is, Swizzy says they released a show about 11-year-old girl trying to twerk. Well, basically, they released like softcore porn of girls. And I don't really know what the movie's about or the TV show or whatever it is. I don't know what it's truly about. So I don't want to sound like I'm too knowledgeable about the subject, but I, I went on Twitter and I watched some, you know, I watched some like three minute video clip from the movie. I don't know if it's a movie and, it, you know, showed these girls doing like the WAP dance and dude, it was nasty, man. It was like, you saw camel toe and everything of these 11 year old girls straight up, you know, like pretending to, they were doing all these nasty sexual moves and, you know, I, I I don't mind sexuality either. I love, I'm a sexual person myself, but like 11 years old. And I think from what I was reading, it was meant to be like educational, like this is what girls do and we shouldn't allow this. But in the end, the material re you're releasing in the video is of girls basically doing pedophilia, softcore porn for girls, right? For 11 year olds. So man, it was so cringy and it was so gross. And then uh, both people on the left and the right got cancel netflix trending on twitter and really crazy he says but everything is porn that's right everything is porn there should be no rules advertising that's right advertising i have children and that's not what you're supposed to do i know right it's not what you're supposed to do right how many times did you reply the video though how many times did i what reply the video i didn't reply on twitter at all i just watched the little clip and said oh that's pretty pretty shameful that's pretty shameful. Yeah, it was pretty bad. Oops, I just did two at a time there. We support Misty's tears here. Well, Misty's 30, okay? She's 30. Misty's of the age of an adult. <laughs> oh, he said, how many times did I replay it? No, I didn't replay it, trust me. I showed my wife, and she, she was really upset by it. It was pretty gross. What do you think about the Hidden Fates Rayquaza? I feel that like he's undervalued as a PSA 9. That's a good question. PSA 9 Rayquaza? Uh, yeah, I don't know. Oops. The photo is when he was, she was 10. TCC, do you have kids? I have uh, kids in my nutsack. No, I don't have kids yet. I can make them. My wife and I don't want to have kids till we move out of this condo. This condo is like chokingly small. Like you have no, you can't even walk in this, especially with this little business I'm running, basically this live stream where we have like a bazillion cards. It's, there's really not enough room. 
Here we go. Let's get the dice rolling. All right. Landing on eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. He says it's been 20 years since she was created. What? Here we go. L. Wines, Red Flare, Christian Moss on three. What you got, Christian Moss? One spot in the base. Christian Moss on three. There we go. Sky Blue Bird, Russ, Manny, Gerard. Oh, Gerard on seven. That's going to be the gold bat. Congratulations, Gerard, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, Gerard. All right, the gold bat's been claimed. Gerard on seven. A new member, huh? We got a new member? I didn't even see that. When did that happen? <laughs> new member's name is Keith. No, it's Kevin Hutchings. How did I say Keith? Kevin Hutchings. Wow, nice to meet you, Kevin. Who's next? Oh, back-to-back -back prizes on seven and eight. Manny, 007. Pulling the right to you. Beautiful, Manny. That was one of the most expensive ones. There you go, Manny007. Another round where the beginning spots seem to have the better pulls, huh? That was three. That was three prizes in less than 10 spots. Number nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 19, 20. All right, let's do a quick recount. Make sure we got 20 packs here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, we're done with 20. I'm going to go ahead and put these up top. This is going to be 21 for split second. 22, split second. 23, I sharp. I sharp. Having a nice day, I sharp. Pulling the Tyranitar. Damn, dude. You're pretty new to the channel, and you are sniping, dude. What the hell? Eye sharp. With the Crystal Golem. And PSA 10 Mega Sableye Tyranitar. Crazy. Gerard on 24. Scott Burke. Unexpected 26. There you go. Unexpected. Pulling the Vaporeon. All right. 26. Vaporeon. Unexpected. Unexpected. You still have a chance to win the other one. 27, 28, 29, 30. 31 was never taken accounted for. I guess it's for me. All right. It's for me, and I lost. J JMO, 32. JMO, 33. Russ, 34. Russ, 35. Poke Kobe, 36. Poke Kobe, 37. Gerard, 38. Gerard 38, sniping, dude. Gerard 38, winning on that bonus spot, by the way. That was the bonus spot. Damn, very lucky, Gerard. Gerard having some very heavy luck. Damn, dude. That's the extra spot. That was a snipe right there. Did you see it go right between Poke Kobe? Damn, Gerard. And again, that's the bonus spot. He got that from the giveaway yesterday night. He's like, dang, dude. Sniping, that's right, Gerard, taking both of these. What the hell? That's some heavy luck, man. There they are. PSA 9, Raichu 2. Base set 2. Mega Sableye Tyranitar 10. Vaporeon 9. Inke 10. And Dark Golbat. Can we get more old school cards? I, I try, man. <laughs> I try. You guys eat through these PSA cards like they're nothing. I mean, they don't last. I... I I, you guys should see how many cards that are in the to be shipped box and how many box how many packages are in the shipped box if you guys saw how many i should show you man yeah i should like show you I, the problem is i can't show you because it'll reveal people's addresses let's go ahead and get the next small running i know there's people who have probably been waiting over an hour now to have their cards open we'll have psa 10 dark charmeleon let's see we'll have dark charmeleon We'll have PSA 9 Dark Kadabra. So these two balance each other out. This one doesn't have a lot of value. The other one has a lot of value. All right. So they balance each other out. Here's a Shining Arceus 9. 
Turtonator 10. And Scissor 10, okay? So that's the next round. We got some hot ones, we got some not so, so hot ones. That's how it works. That's what the small is all about. The small is all about having a combination of different cards. So Scissor 10, he's actually pretty fancy. Turtonator 10, he's cheaper, but he's actually still pretty good. This is a Hidden Fates pull, and the Hidden Fates are so expensive now. We have Shining Arceus 9. Admiral Tuesday, I will ship you, but I'm not going to ship you right away, okay? We're going to we're gonna wait a little a while longer. If you want, I can I can refund you the $4 if you want. I can't have the live stream be boring. That That's that's just something I can't do. We're going to take care of a few more people, and then we'll ship you, okay, Rudy? So we got Shining Arceus 9, Kadabra 9. I, I'm going to change the rules on live shipping. I'm going to eliminate it if, if this becomes an issue, right? We'll just remove it. We got Dark Charmeleon 10. I, I would say these two are probably the best right here. He says, I paid five and I'll wait. With live shipping from the live stream if it becomes a problem. If it becomes a problem. So we'll place this. Oh, I got to calculate. We'll just remove it from the... Because I, I can't have the live stream be boring. That's, that's just not allowed. Not allowed. Probably what we're going to do, we're probably going to change the rules so that you can't get live shipping on a bulk box. That's probably what the rules are going to be. All right, so here we go. We got 130. Plus 95. 75 what's this 30 so the cadaver just counts for three spots and the charmeleon oh look at that it comes out to a perfect 50 spots so it's a little bit larger here we go a little bit larger just a little bit ein bison all right here we go Yeah, I'll get rid of live shipping in a heartbeat. 15, 16, 17, 18. I like it. I like that people can get their stuff shipped right away. But number one rule when it comes to making content, people have to like the content. That's the number one rule when it comes to content creation. Number one rule. And I don't mess around with those rules. And that's why I have a successful YouTube channel. You gotta do things in order, right? If it's not fun to watch, then you, you just don't do it. 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. All right, wow, I did not leave enough room for this row. Your names are gonna be squashed on that side. So there's 50 spots. And lots of fanciful cards. Look at that. Fancy freaking Dark Charmeleon. I love it. Dark Charmeleon. Okay. So, Rudy Tab, this is what we're going to do, man. We're going to take care of a few people who have been waiting over an hour to get to see their cards open. And we'll get your cards shipped. Either way, Rudy, you know, when it comes to shipping your cards, they're going to go out tomorrow morning. So, it's not like they go out the moment that I pack them, right? You see what I'm saying? So, we'll take care of you. All right. Gang Job says, one spot in the large. You got it, Gang Job. Gang job. We can't have people waiting an hour for this, though. Perplex has been waiting over an hour. He spots eight. He says spots eight, nine, ten, and eleven, and two random spots in the large. Six spots total. All right. So, perplex. I'm just gonna do this. POV. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, POV. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do each of the numbers you asked. It's too many numbers. It'll take me too long to do that. I'll be looking back and forth between my screen. Red Flare says, here's the remainder for a hidden face pack, Charizard in my dreams. Alright. He would like a Charizard. Let's see. Red Flare. Red Flare was gonna do live shipping tonight. You got Shiny Gibble, mister. Alright, Shiny Gibble. Red flare. Oh, actually, you get a new bag. That's what you get. New bag. I imagine POV gets nothing. He could. Red flare. There's no way to predict the packs. The packs are all RNG in the end. 
I can't count up six different spots. I'm not going to look back and forth between my screen. It's a waste of time. Swizzy Live. What's up, Swizzy? Hi, mister. Too small, too large. Swizzy Live. All right. Is it two Zs? Nope, one, one Z. You got six and seven, Swizzy. And Swizzy, we're going to put you on one and three. All right, cool. Who's next? Now we're making a little progress. I'm Z Warrior. Two rounds of darkness of blaze out of bag. All right, we're actually opening up some cards, guys. What the? Whoa. Whoa, slow down there, champ. Can't open up cards. Here we go. Mr. TCC, give me even numbers. Please, if not put them together, please wink, wink, nudge, nudge three. Nudge, nudge three. Small, sir, the king is reclaiming the throne and all small. <laughs> You're reclaiming this throne. Where will let me deposit my money onto any of my cards? I can't buy any more tonight. Damn it. <laughs> Front me some packs, mister. <laughs> Sneak. You know, if you had like one really expensive card sitting over here with me, like a like let's say it was a PSA card, I would actually do that. I'd say, all right, I'll loan you five hundred dollars against your PSA card, and if you can't pay me back, then I would just take the card. That's what a pawn shop actually does. So I would I would actually do that, but nobody I've never tried that before. You could have it here and it would act like a credit card in a way. So let's see. We're opening these for I'm Z Warrior, right? Where is he? I'm Z Warrior. You ready? Yeah, if you had an expensive PSA card, you could leave it over here and treat it like a credit card. We got Kabu. You will become the POD. What? The pod? Oh, your luck tonight just changed, mister. Rillaboom Secret Rare. We knew there must have been a secret rare somewhere in the darkness of Blaze. We hadn't pulled one in a while. Here he is. At the end of the box, huh? Crazy. Beautiful. Secret Rare Rillaboom. With the Kabu, I might mention. With the Kabu. Damn. That was a really hot hand. Two. Two full arts. Secret Rare Rillaboom. I swear to God, we don't find Rillaboom as often as we find the Charizard. Like, people like the Charizard, obviously, because it's Charizard. The Rillaboom's actually probably rarer than the Charizard. You know, because you run into all these other stupid, like, trainers and other cards, and then Rillaboom shows up every once in a while. It's like, it takes a while, definitely. <laughs> you got the spank going on? What do you think of those emojis, Rush? You like, or you like the uh, spank emoji? Which emoji do you guys think is most popular right now from the custom emojis? All right, here we go. What do we got? We've got Paras Rhyperior. Live shipping, huh? Yeah, we're going to change the rules on live shipping. Change the rules. Damn, that's some spanking, guys. Holy. Toss this over here. Will you hold my bag as collateral? I would, but a bag's not actually valuable to me. If you had a valuable PSA card over here, I would. So you could ship a PSA card to me. That's possible. If you have one, you probably got one laying around in your collection. That is actually possible. I would I would do that for some people. Damn, look at that spanking. Holy. Look at this, guys. What is what a great pull. Look, he got two full arts, two V cards, and Rillaboom Secret Rare. I'm Z Warrior having the best luck tonight. Jesus Christ, man. This is where all the pulls went, guys. He was sniping them. I'm Z Warrior. Where's the oh here it is. Gregory, Gene Hyatt, I Sharp, Irvin, Gene, where's I'm the Warrior? Hello, did we ship you? Giovanni, Harvey, god damn it, why is it so hard to find some bags, guys? Some bags are like really hard to find. I feel like I definitely do this goose chase thing where it will be somebody who doesn't have a bag and they don't tell me, and then I go looking for it, and then like a minute later they tell me. Again, to Gavin. I got two Rillabooms. Yeah, well, I got three Rillabooms. All right, you're getting a brand new bag. No more Goose Chase. The Goose Chase is really bad. Okay, we got Rillaboom. I am Z Warrior. 
fixed. Perfect. Thirty-three dollars to grade that rule boom. Who's next? Who's next? I'm the warrior. Gang job. Three packs of hidden fates for gang job. Here it is. I've got zero Rillabooms. <laughs> what are your thoughts on the new Charizards? The, the new Shining Charizard's ugly as hell. And the Secret Rare Charizard, I told you guys that that was going to be in English, didn't I? So there were people, they were telling me, oh no, they never do the... They never do the Japanese tournament cards, uh, you know, in English. They never do that. And I'm like, they would just lose money if they don't, right? That's what I said. Remember that? And voila, secret rare English charger. You know what I feel? I feel the guys who spent like $7,000 on those tournament, because that's what they were selling for on eBay, by the way, those tournament Charizards. After Darkness Ablaze came out and it was clear that didn't have a secret rare Charizard in it, those tournament Charizards were getting listed at 7 k and I think people were buying it too. And now look at them. They're going to get destroyed by a flood of those cards on the market in English. So I guess they should have waited to make sure that Nintendo really didn't do it. But, you know, people were scared they were going to miss the bus. They're like, oh, no, they're going up in price. I got to buy now. Did you ever open my one pack of hips? Yes, and you did not get anything from it. Wait, yeah, you did. You got one thing from it. You got Gibble. There you go. You got a Gibble. All right. And this guy got Frogadier. Hidden Fates. Everyone loves Hidden Fates. The most expensive set. Who was that for? That was for, for Gang Job. Damn, Gang Job. That was an expensive Frogadier, man. I don't recommend buying Hidden Fates, guys. It's overpriced. It's expensive. I'm openly telling you not to buy it. All right, I don't know where your bag is. Let's give you a new bag. Gang Job. If you guys don't have a bag, please let me know. Saves me a lot of time. Gang job. Mr. TCC, does that mean the current Charger VMAX that will that go down in price? No, I don't think it will. Here's what I think will happen. Well, I think it'll go down in price in about two months. He'll probably start going for about 400 and what'll happen is the secret rare version of the card will <clears throat> it'll go for about a thousand. That's what I think will that's what I think will happen. Okay. Hutchings, we got K Hutchings, two sets Evo in storage. If you have them, I don't know how much they cost, but let me know if I shorted you. Thanks, Mister. K Hutchings, you can't just buy stuff that's not for sale. I'll put it. I'll put you down for fifty bucks. Here you go, Mister. K Hutchings, you can't buy stuff that's not for sale. There you go. You got fifty dollars, Mister. I'll have X Y Evo when they arrive. They probably arrive in a day or two. Hopefully. Who's next? Tyler Livehouse, two rounds of Darkness Ablaze. All right, Tyler, good luck. Kay Hutchings, you here, man? What would you like to do, man? I could probably, if you paid with PayPal, I could probably go in and do a refund for you. Toss this over here. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four. What's up, man? Hey, I don't have XY Evolutions. I put you down for 50 bucks. I could, if you paid with PayPal, I might be able to do a refund if you prefer a refund. But uh, the other thing is you can wait for them to arrive in the mail. Because they're on their way. They just haven't arrived. I do have some in storage, but, you know, I'm trying to decide if I should ever reach into the storage for that. I haven't really made up my mind. They weren't actually for sale, though. We got Sneep, and we got Sneep. Tyler Limehouse, we got a big shipping for you, don't we? I think I got to do two priority mailboxes for you. You got an insane amount of Pokemon cards. All right, here we go. Crobat V, beautiful. That's green. That's green. Tyler Limehouse, the man who's going deep. You're probably going to get that Poke Rich roll, if I had to guess. You can usually tell because somebody will go like crazy deep. We got Senna Scorch. Beautiful. Green. 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 Beautiful. Crobat V, extremely playable. I know that's what I hear every time we pull them. 
It's sad that they don't do the uh, tournaments in person anymore. I hate that they do it online for the card game. All right. T-Lime. Mr. TCC, you're getting spanked now. Oh, I don't think so, buddy. <laughs> you don't know me like that. <laughs> All right, T-Lime. All right, but don't tell Quip. What the fuck? All right, there we go. Tyler Limehouse with the thickest bag ever. Rudy Tab, I was not here for it, but I paid for like shipping of everything. Please let me know. I have a box and a bag. Rudy, we will get to that, okay? Ardenan, one small, one large. What is a Pokemon fan's p favorite place to go in France? All right, so Ardenan was the guy who accidentally went twice. I can put you down for 20 bucks real fast if you want. All right, so... One spot for small. Please let's S-S-S-S-Goo. S-S-S-S-S-Goo. Did he just say that? He did not just say S-S-S-S-S-Goo. He did not just say that. Okay, so Ardenan needs a small and a large. Have you heard of the new shiny Badoof? PSA, the real boom. Also, pretty sure my other bag is in the first box to the left. Okay, gotcha. Gang job. I would like to start a box. Also, I don't know if my large Blastoise went through. All right, he would like to start a box. So, when you have a bulk box, anytime you buy cards in the Streamlabs, you got to tell me that you have a box, okay? And we're going to write your name on it. It is Gang Job. Okay, we got your name down. Let me go put you on the shelf. Oh, I've got no more room on this shelf, man. I need more room shelf. Shelf room. I can't speak. Poke Kobe. 8 and 16 in the small for Poke Kobe. Poke Kobe, you're going to get 9. And 16. I can remember like two numbers. You asked me to do like six numbers. I will not remember. Poke Kobe, your boy Russ. TCC, give me even numbers, please. If not, put them together. All right. You got it, Russ. There you go. You're in the small. Dustin Jones, two small, one medium, one large. Dustin Jones. Two small, one medium. Kitty, you meowing? Cats in the kitchen going meow. One large, right? Oops. There we go. Dustin Jones is done. Daniel Dela Cruz, one spot for the small, please. Let's go. All right, Daniel DLC. I'm the warrior. PSA, the real boom. All right, I'm the warrior. That's all I needed here. Let's see. Let's PSA that real boom. Ooh, so beautiful. Pop this back over here. Pop, lock, and drop it. One small, please. How long is the wait? It's like so long. All right, I am the warrior. Cool. Let me update the PSA requests. Jump down here, jump down here. Let's see, I'm the warrior. After Imes of Warrior, we have T-Hub with one small. What's up, T-Hub? How's it going, man? All right, T-Hub's back. We're all caught up. Time to do 
time to do the live shipping for Rudy. 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 Let's see. So Rudy needs a live shipping. Let's do it. Rudy Tavares. Just do a quick look around, make sure I don't run into anything else of his. I don't think so. Check up here. This would be real easy to check. Okay, we got Rational Jerome, Patterns, Rizot, Pingus, The Professor, P. Vince. Maybe what we'll do for live shipping, we won't change the price, but it'll be like this. If you have a big box, I don't do the live shipping until the Streamlabs is cleared. That'll be it. That way you get the same price, but uh, we, we just can't do it if it's a really big one. You know what I mean? So Rudy Tav, the Streamlabs is cleared. There's zero wait. The, the wait time is zero right now, guys. And we're going to get Rudy Tab shipped now because we got everyone taken care of by going super duper 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 fast. You can get that Streamlabs cleared fast if you skip all the things that kind of waste your time. Rudy Tab. Rust, Christian Moss. That'll be it. If you got like a really big shipping, I reserve the right to... Uh, Clear the stream labs before shipping your item. <laughs> TCC missed some large spots. What? What are you talking about? For whom? That's Dustin Jones. Let's see. Dustin Jones. Give me a second. Too small, one medium, one medium too large. I see. I apologize. Let's get that. I, I misread your message. That's what happened. We got it, man. We'll fix it right now. Just let me finish looking through these for... PSA cards. We're getting all all of Rudy's cards. We're getting all of Rudy's cards right now. Hello. Ruby. Ruby. There's somebody named Ruby. Alright. Pokey Kobe wants to. I don't know if I could do that for you, Pokey Kobe. All right, here you go, Dustin Jones. Where's Pokey Kobe? Pokey Kobe says eight and sixteen small. Did he say large somewhere else? I'm not seeing him anywhere else. Oh wait. Was there one earlier down here? He said 8 and 16 small. He didn't say large. All right. Some medium spot sub smash. What? So here we go. Rudy Rudy Tavares, here's your bag. I found one PSA card for you, Rudy Tavares. It's the Dark Charmeleon. Let me know if that's right. I don't know if there were any others. I didn't see any others. Toss me in the medium for my credit, please, says Ardenan. All right, Ardenan. Very good. All right, you're 12 and 13. And the book box now, right? Let's go get that book box. Actually, first let's go get a medium. Give me a second. Rudy, 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 Rudy Taveras. Here it is. Rudy Tav, you don't even have that much, actually. Hold on. Actually, uh, I don't know if you want to, Rudy, but you can keep your bulk box. Rudy, just keep your bulk box. You don't actually have that much bulk, man. Here, I'll put it back on the shelf. Hello, mister. How you doing? Can you go throw my small bag and tell me what is good to greet in Rebel Clash? Rudy, you you've got like, more. you've got very little bulk. You got like three bags of bulk. Oh, you got like one over here too, I see. But you don't actually have that much bulk. Wouldn't you rather have me save your book box for I when it's more full? Said, so how about this, a PSA 9 Mew? Two secret rare sold for $150. Would you let me have 120 store credit, which I will pay back in my card? Could be a 10. What? <laughs> As well. So let me go ahead and start wrapping this up. Oh, I think you're asking to treat your card as collateral. Is that what you're saying, Snorlax? 
He says, no! What? Smoky Kobe says, it says 8.2410 for the other one. Okay, interesting. Wrapping this up, wrapping this up. He says, I messed up and called it small. Could you just put those ones in the large? Oh, darn it. <laughs> it's got to make the small look all ugly. Wait, did you call it small? Because I don't, I don't swap between them if you call it small. So I have a rule where I don't jump between the games. You said 824.10 small. So Poke Kobe, you might have actually said that by mistake. But uh, one thing I don't do, if you change your mind between the games, is I don't jump between them because it would cause me to have to scratch out names. I don't like scratching out the names. I tell you what, Poke Kobe, I'll do it. I'll do it for you tonight. Um, but please, guys, in the future, if you say something like, you know, spots one, two, three, small, and then later you say, oops, I accidentally meant large, I'm not going to fix it next time, okay? So please keep that in mind. Please be very sure what you want before you type the name in, okay? Be very sure. All right, so Rudy Tav, I'm keeping your bulk over here, Rudy. I'm doing it as a favor, actually, because you will be able to hold on to more of your, you know, if you were to open more cards, let's say, you will be able to keep the bulk. If you change your mind, I can still send the bulk to you, okay? If you change your mind and you want that bulk, I can still send it. Uh, but when I send that bulk, uh, you'll lose your spot on the bulk shelf. That's that's all. You didn't write it yet. I got 8, 10, 24 on one order, 8, 16 in another order. Oh, I see. Well, give me a second, then. Let me look it up. Let me look it up. I see. Let's let's go find it. Okay, there we go. He says, I haven't written it yet. That's good, because we can fix it very easily then. We can fix it very easily then. There we go. All right. Rudy Tab, let's get your address. Oops. That's not what I was trying to do. Anthony Seven, Sky Blue, Ruse. Okay. One medium, one large, Mr. TCC, and thank you for all you do. Hope you and KWIP and Kitty. Like the <laughs> thank goodies. you so much. Once my package, redhead, you guys. Rudy Taveras, please do me a favor and send me a message on Discord with your address. Two rounds of darkness, a blaze I have a box. Rudy Taveras, please send me a message on Discord with your address, mister. Now, Perplex POP says... He has an order with me. Wait, it wasn't Perplex POV. It was uh, Pokey Kobe. Says he has an order with me. Let's go to donation history because it'll be easy to find from donation history. All right, and we're going to look up Pokey Kobe. Poke. I think I just searched Poke. That'll, that'll work. Pokey Kobe. So you have one that says 82410 on the small. Yeah, I think we already did that one. Hold on, let me show you. <coughs> Poke Kobe, you weren't here probably to see it, but these are your spots spent already. 36, 37, and 39. We already gave you those. So you said on the small, except the spots you wanted weren't available. So I put them into down here, and then we started the small. So you actually got your spots. You got these here. 36, 37, and 30, 39. So those have already been spent, mister. So that's where it was confusing. You were in the previous game. I bought them after you put the Dark Charmeleon down, he says. But I bought them after you put the Dark Charmeleon down. Hold on. Okay, so here's what you've bought. So there's your live shipping. And then you bought these three spots. And then you bought these two sm spots. So that's everything you've bought. You can see based on this date as well. So this was 10. So today, the only things you bought are these two things. Those three spots. And then we started a new sp small. And you got these two spots. Pop that back up there. Mr. Mister. 
it might be a little confusing. Maybe it's because I'm going so fast, but uh, I actually did do them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it, exactly. You say maybe I'm tripping. You should see how it feels like to be me because I feel like I'm tripping all the time when I'm doing this because yeah, there's like, there's so much data. There's so much data that happens. This is a high detail job and it's like, I'm going a hundred miles an hour too. It is so easy to make a mistake, but it's like my actual mistake rate's not that bad in my opinion. All right, let's see. It is, the hardest part is all the information. It's like this huge amount of information. Huge amount of information. So Rudy Tavares, if you're around, I need your shipping address. Let's go ahead and see who's next. Christian Metal, who's been waiting seven minutes. Hello, mister. Can you go through my small bag and tell me what is good to grade and get a Rebel, cl a rebel Clash? Christian Metal, what you're describing is a uh, pre-grade. Would you like me to do a pre-grade? Because we, I offer pre-grading as a service. Um, let's see where your bag is. Your bag's probably real small. Let's just do it for free. Where's your bag? Christian Metal, I think you have a small bag. I don't care. Christian Moss, I'm not trying to squeeze you for money. I think your bag's so small that it's not going to make a difference. Here it is. Yeah, your bag's not too bad. Here. Off-center. Off-center. This one looks pretty good. I'd send off Luzamine. Yeah, it's slightly off center. I, that's like 9.5, basically. Slightly off center, very slightly. So those two are just slightly. They're like 9.5s. Off center, print line, commons. All right, there you go, Mr. Luzamine is your hot pull. There you go, Christian Metal. I, I can't do that for everyone. See, if I did that for everyone, it will increase the cost of the time uh, that it you know to process each order it will it will cost actually quite a bit of time let's grab, grab those rebel flashes but you know what we were we were all caught up tonight which is a nice time to ask that question and uh, you didn't have too big of a bag so who cares here we go did tcc just bent that card yeah the cards can be slightly bent it doesn't really make a difference let me show you so look you can do this it doesn't really do anything to the card see look you can do this all day. It doesn't really change the card at all. Card's exactly the same. Cards are actually pretty hardy. Cards are pretty hardy, actually. Sneep! What you don't want to do is leave a dent on the card. So if you want to damage a card, so if you want to damage a card, you got to do something like this. So that, that's damage. Now you've lost something. Uh, but you can even drop a card on its corner, and it's not enough to cause damage to the corner. Corner will be the same. That's how tough these cards are. They're, they're much tougher than you realize. You can drop these all day. Oops. But but a little a little den like that, that's where the damage comes from. So, you know, you, you got to think about that kind of stuff when you're handling so many cards. Yeah, I used to do, like, some stress testing on the cards because I handled them so much. I used to be like, all right, so what would actually cause damage on the card? And uh, certain activities would cause damage. Like, if I accidentally did this, if I did this, if I did that by accident then the card would be damaged. So I'm, I'm very careful with the moving my thumbs certain ways. Could I see what I've got so far in my bag? It's pretty small if I've got time in a little while. Here we go. We've got Horror Energy. Christian Metal. What's this? Greenback. Greenback. Three, four. I have a question. Where's the best place to get small bulk at? Uh, right here on the TCC channel. All you got to do is ask and, and you will receive. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Oops. Hold on. I made sure to cut my nails before I start opening packs. Ooh, picking up the Dragapult Full Art. That's a really lovely card. I think this card graded a 10. Should probably sell for about $40 to $50. What's next? Dragapult V. Dragapult V. That code card you dented just went from two cents to one cent. Shake my head. <laughs> one more pack. Do you like Milky Ways? Uh, I, I know I like Perky Mommy Milkies. Does that the same thing? It's kind of similar, right? Perky Mommy Milkies all the way. All the way. Toss these over here. And your pull is the Dragon Pull. Beautiful. Christian Metal, I'll pop this into your bag. Why are you doing the Beckett service? Uh, I ended up not wanting to. I'm not a big fan of Beckett. Uh, I don't like their system. Uh, it turns out, it turns out PSA's submission is, uh, system is way better. It's way better. I like. I, I worked on a Beckett submission. I'm like, this is awful. So they need to. They should really consider working on the way that you submit cards to be actually quite similar to PSA. PSA system is pretty efficient. 
Beckett system, they only just, apparently, they only just moved over to doing it online. You would do it by hand. It's like, what? And, uh, yeah, I, I started working on it. I'm like, oh, this is awful. And uh, the, uh, there was another critical thing I learned. With Beckett, you can take your 10s, like this one right here, your PSA 10s, you can take all of your 10s, send them off to Beckett, and have them regraded in a way so that if they believe you can get a black label, they then crack it out. If they can't get a black label, they don't crack it out. So that's the only way I'm going to be using Beckett in the future. I'll be taking my 10s, sending them off to Beckett. If they turn into black labels, I'll keep the black labels. Okay, and I'm not even worried about doing that right now. Christian Metal. Snorlax, I heard you said we could borrow against your uh, our Pokemon. Uh, Snorlax, I couldn't do that. Sorry, Snorlax. In this case, Snorlax, if you wanted to borrow money against your card, here's how it would really work. Let me show you how it would work. So you would you would send me something like you would send me something like this. Let's say Sylveon, and Sylveon's worth uh, let's say three hundred and eighty dollars. And what I would say is, you could borrow up to a hundred and uh, $190. I'd say you could borrow $190 and you will have one month to pay it back or I take your Sylveon. That's how it would work. It'd work exactly like that. So if you wanted to do something like that, we could do that, but it can't be an ungraded raw card. I, I wouldn't, I mean, unless it was like a base set shadowless or something wild like that. <laughs> something like that. All right, who's next? Sub Smash. Two hips for Sub Smash. Two hips for sp Sub Smash. Two hips. Can you send PSA cards to Beckett to regrade? Sneep. Yeah, I know, Snorlax. Uh, in this case, Snorlax, I don't want a, an ungraded card. I don't want to do that with an ungraded card. Here we go. It's got to be a graded card. It'll come back, and then you can do that. You got Jesse and James. All right, Jesse and James. You got a baggie? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Still, still worth going through graded gem. Oh, yeah, Graded Gem exists. I forgot about them. <laughs> graded Gem. I mean, if you want to put your card into a, a plastic sleeve, they're all right. So there you go. Sub Smash. Pulling that hot Jesse James. Rip. Sub Smash. Scott. Slytherin that butt. Sky Blue Bird. Sam 2. Sky Blue. Really? <laughs> Look at this. Did that really happen? They got sorted into each other. Isn't that cool? So what happens, the way I do the baggies is the latest purchase will always gets sorted back into it. Here, let's do that. So people who aren't buying cards, their baggie eventually work, works their way to the back. So you eventually got sorted together anyways. Sam 2, Simple, Snorlax, Sneaky Sub, Timothy Clay. Timothy Clay needs to go up top because Timothy Clay does not spend time over here right now. Sub Smash, Sub Smash, you must be up here. Top cheese, he shouldn't be there. Here we are. Sub Ooh, look at that lovely leafy on. You just pulled the Rainbow Charizard. Mr. Burning Shadow sleep in it, guys. What? No error. What? <laughs> All right. There you go, Sub Smash. Now, did I end up getting a message from Rudy? Supreme, Anthony, Sky Blue. Uh, maybe Rudy has stepped away, but in order to get your... your uh, package shipped. I need your address, Rudy T Tavares. Who is next? Sub Smash is done. Your boy Russ says, one medium, one large. TCC, thank you for all you do. Oh, thanks, Russ. I appreciate it. I appreciate you guys coming in here and watching. I'm a lucky guy. All right. Russ. Russ on the medium. And Russ on the large. All right. Oops, we'll put this here. We're very close. This large is for the Blastoise. Tyler Limehouse, two rounds of darkness ablaze. I have a box. You got it, mister. Can someone explain what I'm watching? <clears throat> Basically, I offer a service where you can have me open up cards in real time and uh, ship it to you. Kind of like DoorDash, but for Pokemon cards. And uh, we open up an enormous amount of cards. And it's very fun and very cool. And Sneep, like this, watch. So here we go. Sneep. So we got a lot of Sneeps and a lot of sounds of a tape roller. And that little plot when the cards, oh. Should I grade the Rainbow Charizard? You should grade the Rainbow Charizard. 
definitely. All right. Oh, you got a box, right? So let's see. Hollow Tapu Coco this time. Hmm. Green. Green. Ooh. Salamence. Do Pokemon cards apply for media mail? <clears throat> Bob can beat you. I have actually used media, media mail to ship cards. It's uh, not something that I recommend, though, because I do not believe they count. I believe they count as merchandise. I've done it once or twice, but it's not something I do very often at all. <clears throat> Caparaja. You get yourself in trouble if you do it too much. Actually, I looked it up. Apparently, they will check your box. They will cut it open to see what you're shipping. All right, Rudy. You end up with the Scissor V Max and Salamence V. Tyler Limehouse. Gotcha. Potashi over here. All right. And we got to get this into your bag, right? Dude, this bag is too thick. I think what we should do at this point, we're going to tie this bag off a little. Thank you for explaining that to me, says Peruvian. What? CGC grading? I, I think the labels, maybe one of the ugliest labels. It's like luxury grading's label. Luxury grading has an ugly label, and so does CGC. Not a fan. The best labels are Beckett, by far. Beckett's black label, and PSA. Those are the best looking labels. All right, Tyler, I'm putting you on the sidebar because that is so large. We're going to start a new hit pulls bag for you because you got that many hits. Crazy, man. If I shipped your case of energy drinks and said it was Pokemon cards, they would cut it open. <laughs> if you ship a case of energy drinks as media mail, that case of energy drinks is like 99% certain to explode during shipping because media mail is going to be the heaviest type of box that they move around in their, their shipping distribution centers. So the reason they have that is because they know paper is super heavy and uh, they, they probably treat it a certain way. So your cans will explode for sure. You sending me energy drinks? You better not be sending me energy drinks. Mmm, mm, mm, get some energy drinks. Let's see, Tyler Limehouse. We just did that one. Snorlax says, yeah, collateral is, is that okay? Last one sold 150, I'll take 120. <laughs> Who's next? Snorlax, in this case, I'd like to do a, if I did, if I did what I talked about, where I gave you store credit in exchange for holding your card as collateral, I would really only like to do that with PSA graded cards, not raw cards. If, if it was a very special raw card, I would consider it. I would consider it in that case. Uh, I tell you what, man, if you really wanted to do that, I could do it for, let me, le let me learn more about it. Let me make sure there's not legal rules about it. So for example, remember when we used to do the raffle? Well, Snorlax, what, you wouldn't remember that. We used to do a raffle a long time ago. I found out that the raffle we were doing was illegal. So I stopped doing it. So I don't know if a pawn shop has to apply for some kind of like, I don't know if it has to apply for some kind of license to be able to do what we're talking about. So let me make sure. Let me, let me make sure it's perfectly legal, okay? How much to grade Luzamine? Uh, I think Luzamine's a $19 grade, I think. Jake H says, spot on the medium. You got it, Jake H. I would probably make you a small offer on the, on the Mewtwo. Do you think Champion's Path will be hard to come by due to the possible shiny Zard? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Let's see. Poke Kobe, too large. You got it, mister. Poke Kobe. Who's next? I Sharp. One spot on the small, one on the large. I Sharp's here to kill. He's got teeth, and he's hungry. He's like, I smell another win. Toss it over there. And we are all caught up. I'm the man. Look at that. Woo! I did it. Yeah, the medium game. If we get this done... If the medium game wraps up, we open up a whole box of whatever they want to open up. Found a place that will have pre-orders for Champions Path tomorrow at 10 Central, fairly below what everyone else has them for. Please, sir. Please, sir. 
it costs different to different cars graded. Yeah, if you have a really valuable card, uh, I charge a little more. That's because PSA charges a little more. Let's see. So let's see. Math says two spots in the med. All right, math. 18 and 19 remain. Can we do live shipping? I have $57 tabs at Supremo. All right, Supreme. Let's see. That's super. What do you got with me, Supreme? PSA cards? Simple, Snorlax, sneaky sub. Tell me what you got, mister. Tell me what you got, what you really, really got. Stephanie, shiny, size of yo, Supreme. That looks like an expensive bag. Shabby, Sam H. Scooter yo, okay. One medium, please. One medium, please. I have four PSA cards. You're the best. That'll save me a little bit of guessing. Kill Jolts. Two spots on the medium. Two spots on the medium. Start showing up. Where the heck are they? Great, my gold, Papa, please, sir. Oh, here we go. One, two. We got two. Three. Two small, one mid, one large, and two rounds of darkness. And four, you are correct. There are at least four. Let's get, let's see the rest of these. Just to make sure. All right. Cool. Good memory. I guess it's not too hard to remember everything you have, though. You know, when it's yours, it's much easier to remember. Oh, hey, baby. Mister, it's Alex PSX put me spot in the car giveaway, Mr. PLS, and thank you. Damn, that's expensive. We got some expensive stuff for me. He's got some expensive stuff for me. What the hell? One small, one med, one large. One med, one large. One med, one large. You think it's just that easy, huh? You think you just say one med, one, one large? Hmm? I think it's just that easy, huh? I think it's just that easy. Please. Yes, I can. Senor. All right. One more wrap. One more wrap. Give this the good old double wrap. The double wrap, double tap. One spot in medium and can you live ship me? Also, Danny DL said, can you add his top hole? Did you say I live ship me? Did you say Mr. TCC? Men in large. Men in large. Oh, it's so easy for you guys. Men in large, they say. Men in large. It's so damn easy. Why well, barely fits. That's what she said. All right. Supreme, I have your address, right? Supreme, do I not have your address? What? I thought I had your address, Supreme. Wait, are you international? Maybe you're international. Give me a second. Whoa, you're international. I got gotcha. you. Okay. So I tell you what, we'll we'll use the money on that card for the international shipping as well. It will be... I think we'll try to get away with $13. I don't think it's... Well, you got all those PSA cards. Man, it feels like it's right on the edge. We'll, we'll see what happens, okay? We'll see what happens. We'll try to get away with it. 
All right, so give me a second. We got to build up this label, guys. Give me, give me one moment. All right, let's see. P.O. Box, what? One five pack of darkness ablaze, Mr. C. I'm not understanding your address here. RPO Bishop Grandin? I don't know what that means. I don't know what the RPO Bishop Grandin means. One large, one medium, one small number, 24. All right, let me go and grab this. You need try and explain what that line that says RPO Bishop means. RPO can just go on the second address. Okay. Let's try that. Uh, I will put it on another line. I don't exactly know what will happen. I've never done that before. All right. Let's try the next thing. Oops. So we got the city. Ship to Canada. Oh, Canada. Da, da. I don't know how the lyrics go, actually. I'm sorry. <laughs> that was pathetic. Terrible at lyrics. Do, 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 do. Canada. I just know those first few lines. All right. And now we put the phone number in. We're getting closer. That's a lot of copying and pasting. All right, and now we're gonna say this is less than a pound. All right, package. So we're gonna say your package is exactly eight ounces. <laughs> oh man. Three small middle, sir. Three small, sounds good. So we're gonna say it's a gift, and we're gonna say it's Pokemans. And we're gonna say it weighs eight ounces again, because it asks twice. And we're gonna say it has a value of about $20, okay? Because if I say it's worth like a dollar, they're not gonna believe me. They're gonna be like, there's no way these are just worth a dollar. All right. The label is printed. Good luck, mister. Tell me if it arrives. It better arrive. If it comes back, I'm going to double charge you, mister. Like poor Cole. Did you put P.O. Box in the first address? Yes. It gave me two lines for the address bar, and I, I put the P.O. Box in the first line. I guess we'll find out if it works. All right, now, this is your card. We're going to subtract uh, $4 from it, first of all. That puts it down to 53 and then we're going to subtract $13 from it. That puts it down at 40. Okay, you got 40 bucks left, Supreme. Your cards are shipped. Now, where were we? I actually don't remember. Where were we? What was the last thing we did? <laughs> I think we put somebody in the medium and the small last. There's Pokey Kobe. How about over here? Math? We put math in the medium. Where's math? Two spots in the medium, and then ruse says one medium. So let's see if ruse is in the medium. All right, I don't see ruse. So ruse is going to go right here. Here you go, ruse. I think it's like that, right? Supremo says Winnipeg. What? Worst city in Canada? Shipping really slow you down. Yeah, it does. It does, actually. Ruse, sub smash, two spots on the medium. Sub smash, you're gonna get one spot on the medium. Here you go, sub smash. Subs, you ready? We're starting the medium. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Don't forget to put me in the giveaway by end of the stream. Also, happy card hunting. What's going on? Why, why am I putting you in the giveaway? Alex. Don't forget to put me in the giveaway by the end of the stream. Also, happy card hunting. I don't know what you mean by that. 
If, if you mean that you put a number in the general chat and you want it to be counted, it, it just doesn't work that way. What happens is when the stream's actually coming to an end, the people who guess when I say go ahead and guess a number, those guys get included. But maybe there's something I don't understand. Mr. Is that last order of mine a new one? This is Poke Kobe. Um, yes? No, wait. No, 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 it's not. This is what you did last, right? This is what you did last. Right here. All right, there you go. All right, Erica's Hospitality is the winning card. Don't forget to put me in the giveaway. What does he mean by that? All right, here we go. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Give me six for the new media, mister. All right, if I remember that, we'll go ahead and do that, sub smash. <laughs> Dust boot. Landed on one. Wow. One, huh? That doesn't happen too often. Mind verifying my e-check? How much is your e-check, Bob? I asked you last time. Here's Dustin. Mike. J Dog. J Dog. Tyler H. Tyler H. Titanic. Cheese. Maddie Merck. Oh. Maddie Merck! We just shipped you, Maddie. 22 bucks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Maddie Merck is the winner of the box. Congratulations, Maddie Merck. Maddie Merck. All right, Bob, I believe you. What do you want to spend your $22 on? Bob, you tell me what you want to spend it on, okay? We need a new medium. What's in the box? He says, Rebels Clash. Sounds good, mister. Bob, did we already ship you? I don't remember if we shipped Bob. One, two. Spank that booty. Better not be spanking. Sub smash. All right, here we go. Easy mode. One, two, three, four, and five. Wow, we're 200 minutes in and I don't have to tinkle. I, I don't think I'm drinking enough. I better take a sip. I don't think I'm drinking enough if I don't have to tinkle after 200 minutes. Here we go, Bob, you ready? Bob can beat you. Speed energy. What? That's green. Three, four. Ice cube. What? What are you doing with that ice cube? Man, that was fun with that charger at the beginning of the live stream, wasn't it? Oh, so good. There you go, Bob. Secret rare frost moth. There we go. What a nice hand. Beautiful pull. You know, I was just thinking that that box was cold because some other people pulled from it earlier today. But there's the secret rare frost moth. Very good. It was just around the corner. It always is, isn't it, guys? It's always just around the corner. Lampin. He's like, yes! That's probably the best card you can pull out of the set, if I had to guess. I paid $10 for a spot for the card giveaway you mentioned last stream. What? There's no $10 card giveaway. What is he talking about? Are you talking about the medium, small, large? What are you talking about, mister? What's your What's your Streamlabs names, Alex? I'll look you up. He got it. Sus smash. Oops, sorry. Paused it and didn't see it. <laughs> All right, Bob. I don't remember if we shipped you. Did we ship you, Bob? I feel like we shipped you or something. Maybe we didn't. Maybe I'm going crazy. 
Let's see if you're up here. The things you're looking for are always in the last place you look. I feel like we did. Andy Dell, Cap. Hmm, I'll check last stream. Maybe I'm confused. Alex, what's the name that you used to pay for on Streamlabs? Because what I'll do is I'll just go look you up in Streamlabs real fast. I can search your history. So you tell me what name you use in Streamlabs, and I'll go look you up, okay? And then at least you use Alex? Okay. Hmm. I don't recognize an Alex PSX. We will look it up. Bob can beat <laughs> you. That seems like a very aggressive name, Bob. You want to go with Bob the Builder? That's a little less aggressive. Let's see. Where's the... You'll be in this box right here. Now, Alex, huh? Let's go look up any Alex's in the donation history. Actually, oh, I see, I see. Hold on. That was from today. Hold on. Alex... Hey, mister, it's Alex. Put me in the card giveaway, mister. Please and thank you. Okay, so it says it says today at 1.47 a.m., which was just a minute ago, you wanted me to put you... So this is all I have for you, Alex. Check it out. So I look for Alex. The only thing I have for you are these two right here. Well, unless, let me scroll down. That's Alex Rod. So, okay, yeah, that's, that's all I have for you are these two right here. And uh, for the card giveaway, I think what you need to do is you need to specify what it is that you want. Okay, Alex? You need to specify what it is you want me to do. We're done with Bob. Where were we? Oh, man, now we got to go to... Give me a second. Let's see. Where were we? Now I'm all confused where we were at. <laughs> Sky Blue Bird. I don't think we helped Sky Blue Bird. Tyler Limehouse, Gray My Tapu Poo Poo. I haven't done that. Sub Smash, two spots in the medium. Ruse, one in the medium. All right. So Sub Smash was the last person we helped, which means that Tyler Limehouse is next. Tyler Limehouse. Uh, funny enough, we just taped your bag up. Let's go ahead and untape it. There we go. Hmm, I don't want this to fall apart. All right, put this back over here. Now, I need a penny sleeve. Not a penny sleeve. I need one of these. Take one of my cards out and put one of your cards in. Does anyone want to buy a pack fresh gold Zamazenta? I'll buy it for $2. <laughs> cool. T lime. Put straight into a top loader after the pack was open. It's sold. I'll buy it. We're going to go over to the. Here we are. PSA request. Tyler Limehouse. You've got Hidden Fates, Tapu Coco. All right, tap of Coco. We did it. Sky Blue Bird, two small, one me, one large, and two rounds of darkness. That's a large order. Sounds good. Just doing a little math there, a little quick math. A little quick math. Sky Blue Bird, one large. That's a long name. Three spots in the medium, please. In the medium, please. So one large, two small. Sky Blue Bird and one medium. All right. Sky Blue Bird. He wants two rounds of darkness of balls. You got any darkness of balls? Hey, master, I'm looking for some darkness of balls. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Rudy Tavares. Did he ever get back to me? So for the bulk, you just pay $13 and you get something called a bulk box. And then I save all your bulk. That's it. So uh, there's two different ways to open cards. You can do bulkless shipping. That's where I drop all your bulk and the shipping is free. Or you can have a bulk box 
where your bulk is all saved in a box on a shelf, but you pay $13 to have that shipped because it's so damn heavy. Ooh, nice. Snip. All right, Sky Blue, let's see what you get. Snip. Some people keep all their bulk. Some people are like, eh, I'm not going to buy too much, so it's not a big deal. I just want my hits. See? That's the difference. So the, the really, the reason you might buy the bulk box is if you know you're going to open a lot of cards. And then you really want to take advantage of having the bulk box because once you have enough bulk, it, it is actually worth it to keep it, but only if you're going to have a lot of it. So it's pretty much that. If you're not going to have a lot of bulk, it's really not a big deal. Actually, you'll lose money if you only open up a few packs because that $13 shipping is expensive. All right. Wait, does he have a box? Sky Blue doesn't have a box, right? He doesn't say he has one. Here we go. We got Ducklet. You like the process? I, I made it myself. Thank you. I designed it. What do we got? We got green. Oh, man. Mel Metal. Mel Metal from hell. What's up, Ahmed? Ahmed Adli Isiraf Mustafa. Wait, I'm not done. Kamal. Damn. That's a name. My name's just like really short. Really good and works for all parties involved. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's how I feel. Some people just don't care about their, bul their bulk and they're like, you know, I'm just here for the hits. So I'll take the free shipping. And uh, then other people are like, actually, I do care about the bulk. So I'll take a bulk box. The only problem I run into is I run out of bulk box spots on my shelf. I have two shelves and they're both com pretty much completely full. I got one shelf with like one spot on it. Whoa, man, these were cold. These were actually extremely cold. You trying to spank? You better stop spanking. Oh, they were all cold. I'm so sorry, Sky Blue. Those were very cold. Those were 10 cold packs for Sky Blue. Perfect. Damn, dude. <laughs> Here, Sky Blue. I'll toss you one of these fancy zards that have been going up in price over time. Sky Blue. Here you go. You just pretend like it's a Charizard from Darkness Ablaze. Damn. Okay. Alex, Alex PSX. Hey, mister, it's Alex. Put me in the card giveaway, mister, please, and thank you. How's it going, Alex? Alex, where did you want me to actually put you? It's important because these games are almost over. I want to make sure you get in. There's the small, medium, and large. What exactly did you want to be put into? What's up, Targon? How's it going, man? He says he wants to be in the small. All right, sounds good. Yeah, so it's important to know which one you wanted. Alex PSX. One round of darkness of all snipe time. See you right there now. So you have a custom booster pack. Poke Kobe says one small, one medium, one large. Poke Kobe. Poke on four. One large. Okay. Christian Metal, can you grade Luzamine, please? Yes, I can. Revenge this round of 2DA. Revenge! Ha 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 ha. Luzamine. Your boy Russ is liking the spank emoji a lot. <laughs> oh my god, dude. One round of unbroken bonds, please. I have Vulcan bag on table. Are you guys okay? All right. Lose a mean. What's up, A-Rod? A-Rod, I've got a PSA card to ship to you, and you did not have any cards returning in the last submission. You want me to just go ahead and ship it? If you do... Send me a message on Discord so I can verify your address is still the same. I should just I should just ship it out. Can I show you what it is? I'll show you what it is real fast. It's been sitting over here for like 17 months. Not 17 months, but too long. I feel bad because I thought I was going to combine ship it with something. I should have just gotten it out. 
Hold on, let me get this thing real fast. I see A-Rod's here, and I just want to show him this. Because this is yours. Sometimes I wonder if you even know you got it. Hold on, I'm looking it up. People getting triggered? <laughs> Too much spanking? <laughs> here it is. All right. So it's been over here for 70 years. Figure I get it out to you. All I got to do to get this shipped to you is verify your address. PSA 9 Charizard promo, okay? So this is yours, A-Rod. All right, let me go ahead and get Christian Metal now. It's been over here the whole time. Go get the PSA requests. Pokemon. Christian Metal. What was that again? It was Luzamine. Full art. Yeah, all I need you to do is confirm it with me on... Man, Rudy still hasn't contacted me. All you gotta do is confirm it on Discord and I will get it shipped out to you, A-Rod. Now... Christian Moss. Christian Moss says, one spot in the medium, and can you live ship me? Also, Danny Danny DLC said, you can add his hot poles to my live shipping. I also have three PSA cards I won. Thanks, Mr. TCC. All right, let's start by getting him that spot in the medium. Christian Moss. All right. Live shipping for Christian Moss and Daniel DLC. Cheese, Arsha, Ardenan, Carlos Gill, Beardy Man, Cirque, Shu, Andre, Black Magic. Was he in the beginning? Oh, Daniel's in a different box. That's what's going on here. Daniel's in this box. E Rod, Daniel DLC. All right, so that's going to be fine. Let me look up these PSA cards. So he said, three PSA cards. Okay, here we go. A lot of shipping tonight. This is the shipping stream. Christian Moss. Unexpected. Have a good night, don't work too hard. I'm always working, mister. We get the hard work done over here. So you guys can enjoy some Pokemans, some entertainment. We can talk about fun things if you want to talk about fun things. Sky blue, huh? Moist man. Oh man, there's so many, so many Pokemon cards over here. What the hell? How do we have so many Pokemons? Oh, here's a Christian Moss. All right, we're at two. I found two now. You said three, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for the third. Christian Moss. I did see it. I did see the Charizard in Champion's Path. What? He's so ugly. <laughs> Am I the only one who thinks he's kind of ugly? That new Shining Charizard? He looks kind of ugly. Actually, it's funny because the um, Charizard VMAX looks way better. Charizard VMAX is going to be the expensive one. He says, I like the style. All right, you got Lurantis, Mewtwo, and Electro. Looks like you did well, man. Live ship for... Ru what's up, Rudy Tav Tavares? So here's what's going on, Rudy. I've got... I've got your stuff packed right here. What I need you to do, Rudy, is I need you to send me a message on Discord. Can you pull my Unbroken Bond and then do the live shipping, please? I sent the money. Oh, God, you guys are annoying. <laughs> Uh, I appreciate you guys taking advantage of combined shipping. Uh, I'll go ahead and let you jump the line, because that's what you'll be doing. Let's have him jump the line so we can get this shipped out for his uh, cousin. <laughs> All right, here we go. Mister, wait! <laughs> I get to open my cards first. I understand, guys. I understand. Let's do it. This will save money, I guess. It won't necessarily save money, but it will be nice, I guess. Let's do it. 
Rudy Tavares. Rudy Tavares, I need you to send me your address on Discord. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay. Rudy Tavares, I, I need you to give me your address on Discord. We got Dedene GX. All right. And that's green. So now these go to Daniel DLC. That's right. Supremo's giving you the spank right now. What's up, A-Rod? Place it over there. Place this up here. <laughs> All right. Just taking advantage of combined shipping. No problem. No problem. Anytime you add complexity to my job, I get, I get like, annoyed. <laughs> it's not your fault, though. I mean, I would ask the same thing, so that's why I'm doing it, because it's a perfectly reasonable request. No problem, Daniel. No problem. It's all for you, mister. What kind of, what kind of business would I be running if I couldn't make you happy? Business is business, after all. Beat him up, Mr. TCC. No, I'm not here to beat anyone up. I'm not here to do that. All right. Base set two in the large mystery mister. Base set two. All right. Somebody actually moving the base set two, huh? Hell yeah. Are you still watching the still game? Yes. Stop asking that, Netflix. So anyway, you think you think Netflix would have some kind of algorithm that can check how quickly I respond. Okay. Whew. Christian Moss. And printed. Boy, you guys are going spank crazy. If you spam, I mute. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's see. One spot in the medium. Did we already do that for him? Yeah, we did, right? Split second says medium. Oh, you tell you what? Let me go see if I can print this label first. Oh, here it is. Okay, so Rudy Tavares. Nice. So you went by Admiral Tuesday. That's why I couldn't find you. I'm Rudy, by the way, he says. <laughs> you don't say. So here we go. We jump up here. That's why I couldn't find you in Discord. Rudy Tavares. I think I spelled that right. Let's see if you have a email address as well. So listen up, Rudy. What I did for you, what I did for you, Rudy, is I did not ship your bulk, just your hit cards. And the reason for that is because I'm recommending that you hold on to your bulk box. You don't actually have that much bulk in it. And you could fill it out with more bulk if you want. If you really don't want to, that's okay too. I can ship your bulk out uh, in, a, in a separate shipment, okay? So you've still got a bulk box here with some bulk in it, okay, Rudy? That's what I'm trying to tell you. In this case, you just didn't have that much, and I, I was going to feel bad if I shipped it because you just you just wouldn't be taking full advantage of it. It's tempting, though, because it would clear a spot up off my shelf. Let me know if you need your bulk, though. I can still ship your bulk out. But then you would lose your spot on the shelf. All right, so let's see who's next. Russ, it's your fault that you got me addicted with that emoji. What? <laughs> split second. What's up, man? He says medium and large for split second, but he doesn't describe the breakdown between the medium and the large. So here's why I'm going to assume split second. The large only had one spot left in it. Split 
second, okay? And then I'm assuming you wanted five spots in the medium. Wow, that's crazy. Okay. <laughs> he says, rip me. I put in three for large, three for medium. Did not write that correctly. Sorry, but I see it's filled out. Okay. I see how it is, guys. All right. Eight and nine are at the very bottom of the list. So I owe you two large, equivalent at $20. Oops. Wait, we don't throw this away. <laughs> We're not done with it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. All right, Blastoise Piplup's on the line. He's a very fancy card. He's worth quite a lot. This card is one of those cards you want to have. You know, it's a starter Pokemon. Piplup, by the way, is also cute. So the card will also have appeal to people who are interested in collecting Piplups. See, it's clever, and. uh... I just think the artwork on it looks really nice. Oh, come on, man. This bag's falling over. <laughs> Oops. Did you get my PSA char? Yes, I did. That's gonna be nine. I got your your Charizard or your Charmeleon. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Did I do that right? Here we go. Swizzy. <laughs> POV. Swi Swizzy again. POV again. Sky Blue Bird, Blastoise Buddy, Louis Riv, Louis Riv, Gang Job, POV, Ardenan, POV, Brody Doan, Dustin Jones, POV, Dustin Jones again, POV again, Russ on 18, Poke Kobe, Poke Kobe, I Sharp, Sky Blue Bird, Poke Kobe on 23, split second on 24. You gotta be kidding me. Gerard just won it. Can you guys believe that? Oh my God. <laughs> Gerard's the winner. Gerard is the winner. <coughs> oh my God, dude. Gerard is the winner. Don't take, do not take the giveaway for granted. I just gave away that Blastoise. Holy. He won that twice. Gerard, the luckiest man right now. Do not take the giveaway at the end of the live stream for granted. Gerard just won two PSA cards today on that, on that, uh, and this one's $230. He didn't even buy that spot. That's what you have to understand. That's Gerard's spot. He didn't even buy that. Man, crazy Gerard. All right. Well, all right, Gerard, I'll let you slip me that five bucks later. Let's see. <laughs> what the? Time to ban him. We need a new large. People are saying old school cards. We want old school cards. Let's see what we got, guys. Rocket Returns. Nah, Rocket Returns are for me, right? How about this? What do you think of this, kitty? Let me see if I got something okay. I got Hypno and Machamp, I guess. Um, let me see if I have something in one of these boxes. Give me a second. Oh, that one's kind of expensive. Nothing in there. I'm checking another box. Give me a second. <clears throat> I would risk my own life for Pokistan.
I am genuinely running out of cards, guys. I actually do not have enough PSA cards to keep up with this. That's pretty incredible. Let's see if I got something listed that I could do. Give me a second. So, I've got a 10. Oh, you know what? Let's do this one. You guys will go nuts for this one. How about this one? So, we are going to do a vintage card. It's going to be Shining Kabo Tops, PSA 8. This is from Neo Destiny, okay? So, we have a Shining Kabo Tops. He's just an 8, and he's just unlimited. I put this one up on eBay, and I get a I get an offer for this almost every day. And the first day I put it up, I got like seven offers in a row. So, people wanted this card pretty bad. So, this is Shining Kabo Tops. Shining Kabo Tops. It won't be too large of a large either. There's going to be 24 spots. Yeah, so the lesson from Gerard tonight is do not do not take the giveaway for granted. That giveaway can be extremely valuable if it plays out if it plays out for you. Oh yeah, there was enough room for this. Okay, 21, 22, 23, 24. Okay. I was worried I was going to have to create a third row. So it's just going to be 24 spots. I know it looks really messy. Now it looks even more messy. That's it. That's the next large. Shining Kabu. Kabu Kabu. I'll probably have to pull them down before somebody buys them. So, Kitty, what do you think of that? Medium large. So, split second is owed two spots. Here you go, split second. Yep, $10 a spot. They go split second. You're on five and six. It's ten dollars a spot. I'm sorry, guys. I should have said that. Alex, he says one pack of Darkness Ablaze. You got it, Alex. Can't believe he won that. That was crazy. Where's Quip? She's sleeping. She's in the bed, all lonely. I'm not there. She's all lonely, man. Sleep. Sexy little, sexy little quip. I mean, I got a sexy wife. I'm not going to lie. I don't know how I got so lucky. She's getting older, though. I'm going to have to, you know what I mean? New model and all that. You're not doing your manly duties. Uh, yeah, I am. I'm opening the Pokemon cards. It's a man's job. What's the price on the large? $10 a spot. I'd rather see TCC. Oh, another Charizard tonight. Yeah, we did it. We need like a bell I can ring. Charizard VMAX. Charizard VMAX. Let's see. Who was that for? That was for Alex X, really? <laughs> That's Alex X's second purchase on this channel, and he picks up the Charizard VMAX. That's unbelievable. The luck to pull that card. How's it look? Um, it looks like Charizard VMAX. Another Charizard. He got both the Charizards. What? Damn. How about that? That is some epic beginner's luck. Holy. Both Charizards? He wasn't even trying. He had a blindfold on. He's like, I got him. Snipe. He's like, how? I don't know, man. People open up so many cards on this channel, and they do not pull that Charizard VMAX. Then Alex steps in. He's like, all right. He's like, step aside, guys. So he's getting a new he's getting a new bag. He he's never had a bag on this table. He's a brand new brand new player. Alex PSX. Did you get my PSA card in the shipping? I sent my address. Yes, I did. I did. I don't know if you heard me say that the first time, but yes, I did. All right, Alex, very good. Rudy, we got you labeled and shipped, okay? Dustin Jones, one large, one medium, one small. Dustin Jones, one large, one medium, one small. There you go, Dustin. You're on eight on the medium. Mike Lamb, three, small, middle. All right, Mike Lamb. You got it, Mike Lamb. Anything for Mike? Mikey. Mikey. Dad, 
Dabs, nice to meet you, Dabs. I think you've been here before, though. Dabs on the large. No problem, Rudy. Who's after Dabs? Dabs, 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 Dabs. Where's Dabs? All right, let me jump back here. Give me a second. After Dabs, we have Bad Breaks. Whoa, Bad Breaks. Seven rounds of darkness, a new box. If so, let's get that Zard. All right, here we go. Bad Breaks. You ready, mister? Bad Breaks, do you have a book box? I don't think you do. Bad Breaks is opening a whole box of Darkness Ablaze. When you open up seven rounds like this, what I do is I just give you a, a whole box. All right. He says, save the Lugia and Lugia reverse. Sounds good, mister. I'll try to keep my eye out for that. I usually don't look. If you see it, uh, that's another case where you can tell me about it. Uh, I'll, I'll try to look for it in this case then. All right. Bad breaks going deep, guys. Whole box of darkness ablaze. Have a nice night. I'll have a nice night. Get some sleep. Sit. What? I think you mean, sir. <laughs> we got to ship coal, though. What about coal? Coal's got to get shipped, man. Sleep. Toss this over here. Here we go. Kitty, what are you doing, Kitty? Have you guys seen how sleepy Kitty is? She lays there the whole night. The whole night she lays there. Sleep. Two small sir together, sir. Wait, Sleep. Ink, nudge, nudge, let's get that into an emoji the next round. Sleep. Sorry, TikTok later with Gentoo. With Gentoo? All right, we got TikTok after this. Sleep. I don't know how she sleeps while we do all this, but she does. She's so desperate to be near me. I could barely walk when I come out of the room. She, uh, she like, trips me up the whole time. It actually used to be annoying. I was like, come on, cat. I got to be able to walk. So desperate for affection. Kitty, I'm a worker. You don't get it, Kitty. I don't got time for pets. All right. We got all the little tops trimmed. Are you ready for that bad breaks? Time to get these pokey pulls, mister. All right. Here we go. Oops. Here we go. We got Yellhorn. Okay, so we're looking for Lugies, just in case. He says, let's get that Zard. I agree. I wonder if there's a faster way I could do this. No. Here we go. We've got Purloin. Purloin. Champion's Path. Are you guys ready for Champion's Path? What did you guys think of the other cards in Champion's Path? It's got the Dreadnought in it. Dreadnought's okay. What do you guys think of Dreadnought? It's got Gardevoir in it. Am I the only one who's tired of Gardevoir? Gardevoir is in too many sets. Dreadnought looks okay. Gardevoir is kind of like meh. Secret Rare Kabu is definitely meh. I've realized over time I'm not super hyped for Kabu. Kabu's just okay. Two cats back to back. Show codes if you want. Codes if I want sounds good. Drag sold. Al creamy. Al creamy looks good. You know you gotta have Al creamy. All right, so we've got Salamans of Vmax. <coughs> Excuse me. Give me a moment. I'll be right back. I gotta have a drink. <coughs> Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. I'm just dying over here. 
any ET <clears throat> any ETA when I'm getting Champions Path uh, today. Today, Champions Path is on its way. I got my Pokemon connections, and they're like, bro, we're going to get you Champions Path like three weeks early. I got the wafer yesterday from Prison Mars. I'm in love. I'm going to conclude. Wink, wink. Oh, my God, Russ. <laughs> it's got the spank going on. So we got a whole box to blaze through. Hey, there's a Lugio. Lugies. Kitty, what are you doing? Round of Ultra Prism for the TikToks. I have a bag. The TikToks. Hashtag get Russ TikTok famous. TikToks. Smoking them tokes. This man said he's smoking the tokes. What the hell? All right, Pokemon Breeder. Pre-purchase Champion's Path. You guys want the ability to pre-order Champion's Path with me? Is that what you said? You want to be able to pre-order Champion's Path? Damn. COVID. <clears throat> we got Talon Flame. Talon Flame. Wow. <clears throat> I Sharp says, "Is it possible?" Well, uh, maybe what we could do is we could start running the medium so that if you want, instead of having a booster box, you could have a, an elite trainer box of, you guys want to do that? What you can do is, so if you win the medium, you can say, instead of having a booster box, I would like a champion's path uh, elite trainer box. So I would do that for you if you wanted. We did that last time with, uh, what was it, Darkness Ablaze? Spanking them cards. Giving them that good spank, man. Oops. That's green. By the way, Matty Merck never said what he wanted. He says, where's the Zard? I know, right? Oh, where, oh, where can my Charizard be? Oh, where, oh, where can he be? Charizard. Too many greens? Don't worry. Tank that Pokemon cards. Damn, Russ. Russ is addicted to the spank emoji. Uh-oh. Nope, that's Butterfree. I need some XY Evolutions. We'll get XY Evolutions. Don't worry, guys. Suicune Scissor. Look at this scissor, man. Ooh. Don't worry, Charizard any second now. Guaranteed Charizard with every box. Bunnelby? I went through a whole box of evolutions with factory lines through all the hollows. Yep, that's right. Mr. TCC, there ain't no wink wink nudge nudge yet. That's right, we need a wink wink nudge nudge emoji. Hey, you send me... Post what a wink wink nudge nudge emoji would look like in the emoji submission channel, Russ, and I'll consider it. Del Caddy, wow, why are these so green right now? Tell them, oh my god, tell them to be hot already. What the hell? This is how it really goes, though, you know? So if you ever open up green packs and you're like, why the hell I get the green packs? And the other guy gets the super hot packs, Alex P PSX here, because that's exactly how it goes, man. Copper Raja. One large, please. Hopefully, I did that correctly. Hopefully, but what if you did it wrong? Punishment? Spankies, maybe? Let's get some spankies in here. Oh, Galarian Slowbro. All right, got that good Galarian Slowbro at least. There we go. You ready for the hot stuff? Crowbat Full Art. All right. You think you got one more shot? I bet this is green. Yep, green. No secret rare, no Charizard. Man. I'm telling you guys, when you pull a secret rare, cherish that secret rare because not every box has one. That's all I got to say. Not every box is blessed with a secret rare. 
you've got to appreciate it when you get it because they're actually pretty rare. One small, one medium. No, possible, sir, mister, sir, mister, sir, sir, mister. The energies I use for shipping. All right. What do we got? What do we got? So we place these over here. You did pull a Lugio. I can leave this up for you if you want. Scam is ablaze. <clears throat> wow. Oh my god, this is like... Oh, okay, there's three full arts. So Salamence, Crobat, Pokemon Breeder. Those are your full arts. No secret rares, no Charizard this time. I know, man. Yeah, that is tough, right? But everyone, when they open up a box, they imagine themselves pulling a Charizard. They imagine themselves pulling a uh, Rillaboom with this Gorilla Grip. But uh, it is, in reality, they're they're fairly rare. They're fairly rare. You have to go through a lot of stuff before you get the good stuff. So let's see. That, went, that was for whom? Who was that for? Bad Breaks? Bad Breaks? Better luck next time on pulling the Charizard. Let's find your bag. Bad breaks. Here we are. I got Colossal Secret. If you get CP early, are you going to sell early on here? So I tell you what, guys. If you win the medium, you can you can request, instead of a booster box, you can request a an elite trainer box of... You can request an elite trainer box of Champion's Path. As for the price on Champion's Path, I don't really know <clears throat> what it's going to be. It's going to be all about how hard it is to obtain. Prison. For the TikTok, for the TikTok and so the Champion's Path doesn't... Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. So Champion's Path <laughs> it doesn't come out for like... Till the 25th, right? So we're still two weeks away. And the price on it could change dramatically now that there's new information that reveals there's two Charizards in the set and you get one in the box anyways. So if anything, the Elite Trainer... I'm sorry, yeah, I said that right. The Elite Trainer for Champion's Path is probably undervalued. I don't know. I mean, I guess if everyone gets it, is it really that rare? But I don't know. We saw a pretty big explosion with Hidden Fates last year. Maybe it'll be that all over again. We, we'll yet to find out. Pre-order price jumped today after the news. Yeah, it sounded like it. Some are having Champion's Path two weeks early. You sound like you got COVID. That's right. I got the COVID. I'm coughing a little bit. I had a drink to try and help. Um, I'm a real man. I'm a real man. You, sir, Corona. You got Corona. You sound sick, says Mr. Bar Bar Barrera. Well, anyways, so yeah, if you guys win the medium and you would like for me to get you a box of Champion's Path, I am open-minded to doing that. Basically, what I'll do is I'll write you down on a card. One Elite Trainer box of Champion's Path is all yours. Uh... That is just one of the options. Of course, you can just open a, a box like you normally would of Fates Collide or Darkness and Blaze or whatever. Okay, so it's just an option. Let's see who's next. Mark Fitch says, speaking of which, Mark Fitch says three, sp three spots in the medium. Mark Fitch. Mark Fitch. Nice to meet you, Mark. So, Maddie Merck is actually owed... A reward from the medium and if he wanted to me to write him down for a champion's path the elite trainer box i would let's see id chronicle says one round of darkness of balls snipe time question mark snipe time that's right snipe time we love snipe time it's our favorite time did maddie merck say what he wanted I don't know if Matty Merck's even awake even anymore. Sneep. Shining Kabutops is the new large. It's $10 per spot. What do you think of that, Kitty? Kitty's pretty pleased. All right, here we go. ID Chronicle. Pulling the Mew, uh, Mew V card. Not hollow. You know what Champion's Path feels like? Champion's Path feels like it should have been Darkness Ablaze. All those cards should have been in Darkness Ablaze. And they said, nah, let's split that into an Elite Trainer box. That's what it feels like, by the way. Ooh, Eternatus VMAX. Beautiful. Look at that. That was a snipe. So look at that. One guy opens a whole box, no secret rare. One guy opens up five packs, immediate secret rare. That's how it happens. 
that's how it happens sometimes. For me, oh man, that was the biggest snipe ever, dude. What the hell? Dude, what is this? Okay, it's just a hollow. All right, dude. Look at this snipe, man. You just pulled like some of the best contents of a box out in one round. By the way, I just want to mention that was the end of a box. So no more in that box. Damn. ID, do you have a bag already? I feel like you do. Let's see, JKL, you'll be on the side here. Oh, this book's getting really insufferable. Eye sharp. I need Chronicle. Here you are. Looks like you haven't opened anything in a while. Perfect timing, huh? Look at that. You just had a very good night. That's cool. Pulling out them secret rares tonight. Rillaboom, Eternatus. We got two Charizards came out tonight, right? Sky Bluebird. Revenge this round. Two Darkness Ablaze. Sky Bluebird. Oh, man. You know what happened? Let me, t let me tell you exactly what happened there, guys. Sky Blue Bird. Sky Blue Bird opened some. Darkness Ablaze. Pulled nothing but greens. And then Ivy Chronicle came in and took the pulls. That's exactly what just happened. But don't worry. We're in a fresh box now. That is how it goes. I don't like that black shiny Zard either. He's ugly, isn't he? He's kind of ugly. Sneep. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good luck. Let's see what you got. Hey, can you open two medium? I can't open any mediums until they're all sold. All right. Sky Blue Bird. Good luck, mister. Starting out with Salamis V. Face on the shiny black card looks off. Rainbow looks better. Double rainbow. Hey, Mr. TCC. Looks like I can sleep in peace. What do we got? We got Fletchling. And I buy. Yes, you can buy. It's $10 per spot for the medium. You have to pay using Streamlabs. Don't use, don't use Super Chat. Super Chat cannot be used to pay for these. This is green. You still have more Darkness Ablaze, right? I got tons of Darkness Ablaze available. There's still plenty available. Let's see. What do we got? And for small, we have some PSA cards in the small. Oh, no. Come on, man. Decidueye. Oh, my lord, dude. Oh, my lord. Just the Salamance, huh? I tell you what. Let's get you a nice hit. Give, give me a second, Sky Blue Bird. That's annoying. That's annoying. Give me a second. Well, I open another pack for you, and you end up with the stun fisk. I mean, it's technically a hit. Oh, give me a second. Five dark balls. Five dark balls. All right. TCC, looking out. Let's see. Well, I was trying to get you a better pull there. All right. Let me go to donation history. There we go. So we're gonna jump back in here. Give me a second. All right, Sky Blue Bird, I'm so sorry, mister. That's really not happy to watch. Here, have a Houndoom. All right. Sky Blue Bird. Sky Blue Bird. All right, but only this one time. Next time, not so much. Daniel Dela Cruz, one round of Unbroken Bonds. We took care of that. Bad Breaks, one medium. Also keep the book on the box opening later. What? 
Keep the bulk on the box opening later. Take out Lugia. Oh, I see what you're saying. All right, bad break. I got confused there, bad break. Here we go, bad break. Small price is also 10. Tyler Limehouse, three hidden fates, I have a box. I got one hidden fates. I need another 10. Here we are, here's a 10. Let's see. Tyler loves his hib. Tyler does love his hib. To please mister. I will sacrifice my own life for Pakistan. Pakistan. Chinese art confirmed. Do you ship to Pakistan? I ship to Pakistan. All right. Wait, was this Tyler? Oh, this was Tyler. Here we go, Tyler. You ready? Tyler, you got reverse hollow green leaf energy. I will, I will sacrifice my... I love Pakistan. I will sacrifice my own life for Pakistan. Here we go. What do we got here? Reverse hollow water energy. Man. Looks really clean, actually. Believe it or not. And it's got a little dot on it. Come on, last pack luck. Fro Froki. Froki, you can get to... Oh, I'm just kidding. Froki, all right. Grape. That's grape. We're going to go ahead and do this. All right, Tyler. Not the hottest pulls. Super expensive. Hib Hibben Fates. Hibben Fates. How do I pay? Use the Streamlabs link in the description. Please read. Please read the instructions in the description. Read the instructions in the description. It, te it teaches you everything you need to do. There's a few steps. Most importantly, I need to have your shipping address. We're getting you a new bag. So, Tyler, I remember, you got a real thick bag, and we put it aside. We got a new bag for you, Tyler. Tea lime Targon's Tavern. Oh, my God. Here we go. Base set two and the mystery. All right, here we go. Targon's in, guys. A base set to mystery and a large. Hopefully, I did this right. There you go, Targon on fourteen. Oops, it looks like I scratched you out, but I know I didn't. So spot number fourteen's gone. Spot number fifteen will be finished by this game, which is almost done. Look at that. All right, cool. Cool. Targon in the large. Targon going right for the vintage stuff. Gentoo, one large, one medium. Gentoo. Is that the large? Yeah. One medium. Ardenan, what's up, Ardenan? Two large, eight, and 18. Here's 11 and 18. Your boy, Russ. Too small together. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. All right, Russ. 21 and 22. Gantul Penguin, round of Ultra Prism. Round of Ultra Prism for TikTok? Oh, for TikToks. All right. I will sacrifice my own life. I can't get it out of my head. Ultra Prism. Toss us up here. Sweet. Pope Master Flex. Pope Master Flex. First time, one large, please. Hopefully, I did that correctly. All right. We got the Pope here, guys. It's Pope Mastaflex. Pope Master. Arsha says, one small, one medium. Both in the middle. Arsha Aden.
Medium, right? Yep. LSX God, five darkness of balls. You got it, LSX God. Give me a minute. Let's get these Pokebucks, mister. All right, we got the Pokebucks. Can you tell me delivery charges? If you drop all your hits and you live in America, you can have free bulkless shipping. If you want all your bulk and you live in America, $13 for a bulk box. If you are international, is $13 for the first eight ounces. If you're international, is $23 for the first 15 ounces. So I have your bag. Those are the delivery charges. Now you know. You can read about them in the description. All right, LSX God. About to pull the hottest darkness balls of his life. Sneep. 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 All right. All the sneeps came in. So beautiful. So much sneep. I got school tomorrow. You have a nice day at school, mister. Ooh, a beautiful Galarian Stunfisk. The card everybody wants. The number one card in Darkness of Balls. Can't get enough of them. I want one medium booster pack. How much, please? It's $10 for a medium booster pack. Remember, though, you have to pay in Streamlabs, okay? You have to pay in Streamlabs. Streamlabs is basically just... Streamlabs is basically just your choice of PayPal or credit card. Pokey Breeder? What? Pokey Breeder's nurturing. It's so nurturing. Hold on. You lost faith in Darkness Ablaze? Oh, Galarian Stunfisk. That sounds like a good title. Losing Faith in, in Darkness of Blaze. <laughs> Do not pay with the Super Chat. If people in this chat are telling you to pay with the Super Chat, I'm going to give them the Super Ban. Because that's real money. You're, you're going to get. You're gonna cost them to throw their money away. Don't do that, guys. It's a funny joke, but it's actually real money. So I think one guy got burned on that, okay? Hand out some bans. That's LSX God. He's like, I give up on Darkness of Blaze. You got an Eternatus VMAX right there. What are you talking about? Using credit card? Yes, you can use a credit card. Credit card works with Streamlab. All right, let's see. We're jumping back to the analytics. What do we got next? LSX God is done. Alex says, five Darkness of Blaze. Please, mister. You got it, Alex. Alex about to get the hottest five cards. The LSX missed by one round. You can use credit or PayPal with the Streamlabs. Yes, there's a link in the description for Streamlabs. Gonna swing that ban hammer. Yeah, if you guys tell people to use Super Chat to pay for cards, you're gonna get banned. Because that's their money. You're actually causing people financial harm. It's almost like fraud or theft. Here we go. And we don't do fraud and theft in here. We only do cold packs. We got Lunatone. <laughs> Pack number two. Ba ding 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 ding. I give my own life for Pokemon. <laughs> I give my own life for <laughs> What are the actual words? Like what <laughs> I don't know <laughs> I don't know if I have the exact right right words for it. Starly. Sadness of Ah, here we are. This will be the hit card. You ready? No. <laughs> no, it is not. In fact, it is not. Beautiful. How much does a PSA 10 Eternatus VMAX go for? I would bet that he would probably sell for maybe $150 would probably be a fair price. But that depends on when you sell them. If it takes you a long time to sell them, it might go for a, it, just 100 I don't know. It's, it's a good question. It's a good question. All right. So we are now opening up for who are we opening up for? Erod, Sadness Ablaze. Give the cards to Cheese. All right, they're all going to Cheese. My own life, Pakistan. One small, one medium. One small, one medium. Nice to meet you, Tiger Boy. Open on the live my package. I will try to, okay, Russ? TCC, are you Pakistani? I'm so Pakistani. No, I'm in the U.S. 
All right, here, ow. here we go, Erod. My dad won't let me buy. He said that only cash on delivery. Huh. Interesting. Where are you from, mister? Wow, great. <laughs> oh, here's a white back. What do we got on the white back? Is Salamance VMAX? Do they even do COD anymore? Does even does who do COD anymore? Base set mystery. Thanks, Mr. TCC. Mr. TCC really live, love Pakistan right now. That's right. Billowing smoke. <laughs> yeah, you Pokemon cards. Where are you from, mister? Ooh. So we're going to go ahead and put this into Erod's bag. Erod. One medium spot, please. And Tiger Boy, one small, one medium. Tiger Boy. I met Tiger. And Tiger met man. Who remembers that? Tiger King? God, that was insane. It's crazy how much time has passed with all this COVID, right? The days go by. They really do. Daniel Dela Cruz. One spot for the base set two mystery. Daniel DLC. I sharp. One round of broke unbroken bonds. Let me go find them. Give me a second. Actually, do I have a round right there? No, I don't. Okay. Oh, they're right here. Okay. I want that stun fisk. You want that stun fisk? Hell yeah. E Rod's he's going deep for the uh, you know, the full art stun fisk. I know I would. I would give my own Pokemon for Pokemon. You're from Pakistan? Did you know there's a big Pakistan uh, meme on the internet right now? The the one with the school children that are all pledging like allegiance to Pakistan or something like that. What do you guys think of that? Do you guys are you aware of it? Do you guys find it funny? Do you invest in booster boxes? Booster boxes? Do I invest in booster boxes? That's a good question. Oh baby, did you just pull Green's exploration? He just pulled Green's exploration, guys. Look at that. There we go. Green's Exploration. That's, I'm pretty sure, going to be a very hot pull. Cheese is already jelly. Cheese is like, what? I will be pilot. I'll see if you're... Actually, no, it's I will be army and protect Pakistan and destroy India. He says, no, I don't know. I never saw it. Oh, interesting. Yeah, if you get on the internet, man, you got to go look up the Pakistan meme. There's a... It's a, it's a that's funny. He's not even aware of it. Who was that for? That was for iSharp. iSharp, you're doing way too well on this channel. We're going to have to nerf that. I'm just kidding. That's not how it works. Nobody ever gets nerfed. You can do as well as you want. Let's see. Gerard, Gregory. You just got to stop sniping, mister. All right. Green's Exploration. That's probably a $100 card if I had to guess. Give me all your luck. Gus S, but one medium spot, please. Gus. Very nice. Good. Erod, I want that stunfisk. I know. I know, we all want the stunfisk. Dude, I want to stand up. It's what I want to do. My back's hurting. Too much sitting, man. Five hours of sitting every day, seven days a week. What do you think that does to you? That can't be good, right? Ow, there's like something on the table stabbing me. What the hell? I want that Cabo Tops. Cabo Tops. Green. Vegetable, vegetable. One base set spot in the middle if possible, sir, mister. One base set spot in the middle if possible. Yellhorn. Uh, I don't know if the middle is possible anymore. It's pretty far along. How does TikTok opening after YouTube stream? What's the link to it? Oh, uh, so I... Oh, here we go. Secret rare big parasol. We knew there was something around the corner. It's a big parasol rather than a little boom, though. Hmm... 
Now you have an umbrella for all your tears. The Dene. I saw Tiger. The Tiger King. What did you guys think of all the poly, poly polygamy or polyamory or whatever it was in Tiger King? Did you know the Tiger King guy apparently had more husbands than two? They just didn't show it. They didn't talk about it. What the hell? I learned about that later. What do you guys think about that? What's up with all that? They're all like, you know what I need? About six partners. Toss that over there. Arsha, one base set spot in the middle, if possible. Arsha. Oh, God. I just saw the meme, the pledge one, right? Yes, yes. I will sacrifice my own life for Pakistan. They say there's a whole bunch to it because it's it's a long video and many parts of the video is is enjoyable. It's funny. Mister, how much would it be to grade that greens exploration? Let's do a little research. It's going to be based on what it goes for in the market. Unbroken bonds. Greens. Here, let's type in exploration. PSA 10. All right, are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? There's one for sale for $300. That's the only one. So if you want to grade your greens exploration, uh, it'll be a $33 grade. Let's see if the one completed recently. Yeah, so one completed recently for over 100. Or no, for, for 100 markdown, I'm sorry. Respond to offer. I got an offer. What did I get an offer on? Why these guys? They People make like terrible offers. People make terrible offers. All right, let's see. Two rounds of darkness ablaze. I have a box. I have a box, says Tyler. All right, Tyler, let's get it. Three, four, and five. Would you know how much to grade a Charizard VMAX? Yeah, so it's the same deal. It'll also be $33. Why would someone pay so much for just a graded card? Uh, it's a good question. It's, I guess it's, it comes down to collecting cards. It's a hobby, right? So you want to have a fancy card, and so does everyone else. And so the buyer says, well, I think a lot of people want to buy this, so I'd like to offer it for a lot of money. Gus says, did you get my medium spot? Did I? One medium spot, please and thanks. I'm just that fast, Gus. You didn't even see me do it. You blinked and it was over. You blinked and it was over. Wait, Tyler Limehouse, he keeps this stuff. Oops. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Green. Awesome, the stream stopped on my end. Oh, that sucks. What do we got? Did you get my large? I don't know. Did I get your large? Brett, Pope Master? Yeah, I did. Pope Master, you're in. Green. Oh, and a white back. We got Crobat. Look at this Crobat. Beautiful. Pink Kirchen. Crobat. Oh, man, these beautiful Crobats. All right. Did someone ever tell you that Crobat is very playable? Wow, I think Crobat is very playable. I could be wrong, but I heard that Crobat is really playable. Did you guys know that, that Crobat is really playable? That's pretty wild, isn't it, that Crobat is so playable? It's like it makes me want to play with them because he's so playable. Tyler Limehouse. Don't. What's up, Arsha? What the hell? Most playable card I've ever seen, as a matter of fact. <laughs> All right, picking up the Crobat and the Crobat V. He's quite playable, in case you didn't know. How many spots left in the medium? I will sacrifice my own life for Pokestan. We got one, two, three. Three spots, and then it starts. No printer, just facts. What is the new large? The new large is Shining Kabutops 8. Hold on, let me refresh this. All right, there we go. All right. 
Whoa, what a night, what a night. We are just shy of five hours. We're still going though. Let's see, we got five fates, five fates, three ultra prism. That's that's set up for dark or for um TikTok. Does anyone want to open anything else on the Tiki Takis, huh? Do, 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 do. One more spot in medium, please, sir. You got it, Gus. So let me talk about something. If you guys win the medium and you want to have some champion's path because you're crazy, I will let you reserve a box of, of champion's path with me, okay? So you can say, hey, I want to reserve a box of champion's path, and then when they come out, we'll open them up for you, okay? Or I'll directly ship them or whatever. I'd I'd love to open a bunch on TikTok, says Gentu. Mr. TCC, you missed my TikTok error. I missed it. I'm sorry. They're making boxes of Champion's Path. No, I mean like Elite Trainer Box. You know what I mean. I should have said yes to confuse you. I should have been like, yeah, didn't you know that? <laughs> okay. Here's my here's my pack of Darkness Ablaze. You ready? This one's for me. Automatic Charizard. Oh, I got something. Salamis. Amazing. To medium, please. It's my birthday. Maybe you'll get lucky. Maybe you'll get lucky. It's your birthday. Let's see. Let's go ahead and move this over here. And we'll toss this over here. I will sacrifice my own life for Pakistan. It's your birthday. Zero. I had a large and base set too, I believe. Am I missing? Am I missing one? Hold on. This is important because. So, Akatsuku. I can't say your name. Akatsu. How do I say this? Akatsuki? Akatsuki Cloud 9. Base 2 and large. Hopefully, I did this right. All right. My bad, man. I, I must have missed you. I must have missed you. I'm sorry. So this should be your spot. Let me write your name, though. There. Akatsu. 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 There we go. Akatsu. And what's the other part? Cloud 9. Akatsu Cloud. All right. So there we go. So you're on 18. I apologize. I did actually miss you. Weird. You wouldn't think I would because the name is actually really large. I'm just say Akatsu 9. That's good enough for me. So... You are in. You made it in just before it ended. That could be a bad thing. You'll find out. So, and Zero would like two mediums. Zero, you're getting one medium now. And then we're going to put you on the next medium. <laughs> and we're starting the medium. Here we go. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, 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 you're going to be sad if the 18 goes to Akatsu. But, you know, Akatsu came in first. He, he purchased that spot, so it's rightfully his. You just didn't know it at the time. All right, here's the winning card. Let's find out what happens. I will sacrifice my own life for Pokistan. Okay, whatever. Just going fast. All right. Landing on 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We're ready to open our custom booster packs. Nobody knows who's getting what. Split second on 1, on 2, and on 3. No luck. Pokey Kobe on 4. Sky Blue. Sub Smash, Christian Moss on 7, Dustin on 8, Mark Fitch on 9, 10, and 11. And that's the winning card for Mark Fitch. So in this case, Zero, you're lucky that you're in the next game because you weren't going to get the winning spot. Mark Fitch did. Congratulations, Mark. Mark's new, by the way. He went deep. He bought three spots. Mark Fitch. Did I just throw the card away? That's okay. Mark Fitch, where you at? Mark Fitch. All right, this, because that's the booster box sign. 
Mark Fitch, what would you like to get? I can get you Darkness Ablaze right now. I got Rebel Clash right now. That's basically it. Uh, I could put you down. I could reserve a spot for, like, Fates Collide. I can reserve a lot of things. I can reserve Fates Collide, Crimson, Invasion, Sun and Moon base set. I can reserve uh, Champion's Path can be reserved if you'd like for me to put you down for Champion's Path. So those are all options. You could do Champion's Path. He says, Darkness Ablaze. We're opening it right now. Woo! Darkness Ablaze time. Let's get the new medium started. All right. So let's see. At zero, there you are. You're on five now. You want your bulk mark? Or just your hits? Am I out of darkness, boys? Give me a second. Five, uh, Ten dollars a spot. All right, I gotta get a new case. Give me a second. Whoa. Ow. I'm in on the base too, yes. And Mark says just the hits. All right, sounds good, mister. We'll blast through this faster than your dad blasted through your mom. my bag for sir tcc you think is so easy oh wait huh. there we go we just do that good luck on your pulls mister scoot this chair in my back's getting tired seriously so we're we're just shy of five hours try and blaze through this darkness ablaze style Ooh, I, I was snipping the, I was pinching my finger there with the blade. That's what I'm more scared. Of. I'm more scared of cutting my fingertip than I am of cutting the actual card. It's it's easy to avoid the card. It's my finger that I'm scared of. I'm gonna cut my fingertip off in the middle of the stream. Blood everywhere, all over the table. <laughs> Sleep. Can we do three at a time? Dare I? Mr. TCC, don't forget my Tiki Taki. Sounds good, Russ. We'll get that Tiki Taki all opened up for you. And you're going to win, right? Who are you playing against? Wait, you're not on the TikTok card. You must have purchased some later. Do you collect cards? Uh, no, I just open Pokemon cards up for a living. I don't collect them. That'd be crazy. Who collects cards anyways? All right, good. So let's get these off the table. All right. Who was the one of that? Finch, right? Is it like Mark Finch? Mark, be sure to contact me on Discord and get me your address. All right, so I, I, I gotta have your address for shipping. And we start out with the Scissor V. Beautiful. I like the Scissor V. I think he'll be a popular card. He'll probably be worth in the $40 range as a 10. He should go for at least 40. We got Glimwood Triangle. Ah, I didn't, I didn't snip deep enough for this one. Mark Finch. There we go. I was skipped, I'm pretty sure, but it's okay. What? You were skipped? That's not allowed. I'm not allowed to skip people. Probably just in line. Snubble. Oops, green. We got a green pack. Heck yeah. Never seen a faulty sneep. Eternatus. I've been doing this so long. My muscle memory for my hands is like crazy good. 
There's probably a record of how fast you can open up cards. That pack got snipped. That's right. He says, but it's wait plus if not, I'll just go to Tiki Talk. You're going to go to Tiki Talk? Tik Tok Heaven? You're going to go to Tik Tok Heaven? Stay away from the light, Russ. Russ, no. Come back, Russ. Stay away from the lights. Don't go into the light, Russ. For Bravo. Oh, what are these greens right now? Jeez, Louise, Louise. Larvesta. Hey, here we go. This will be your Charizard, though, right? We don't care about greens as long as the box has Charizard in it. Now oh, Blaziken. All right. Here we go. This will be the Charizard, though, right? That's right, Purier. Hmm. That's not Charizard. Where's Charizard? You should show this fast pace on TikTok. It's pretty fast, isn't it? The light is shiny like Charizard from Hidden Fart. <laughs> We've got Senescorch. Okay. Two more packs. And then we go to the other half of the box. So far, we've got a couple of V cards and a scissor. But that's all going to change. But not right now. <laughs> Salamance V. You got seven Rhyperior. That's a lot of Rhyperior. Hippopotas. All right. See how many packs you can get through before TikTok runs out. All right. God bless anyone who likes Senescorch. Senescorch is okay. What do you got against Senescorch? He's kind of cool. What is he? He's modeled after a centipede or something like that. He looks okay. Oops. All right. Second half of the box. This is the part of the box that has a charger on it. I'm sure of it. I called the Pokemon card company. They told me this half of the box has the Charizard. Teddy Ursa. Too many Santa Scorch? Yeah, you know, it doesn't feel like there's that many cards in this set, does it? This set actually feels pretty small. I want to mention again, you know what I think they did? I think that... The cards you see in Champion's Path were probably meant to be in this collection, the Darkness of Blaze collection. But then they're like, oh man, we gotta have something for Christmas. And they're like, well, just take the Secret Rare Charizard out of Darkness of Blaze. I think that's what actually happened. It's it's kind of greedy, but it's like, people are still gonna go crazy for it anyways. So maybe it's not greedy. Maybe it's the actual demand in the market is that high to justify it. So Vilas, yeah, I think the Secret Rare Charizard should have been in this set. And they're like, nah. they went, nah, don't put them in. I think that's what happened. They're like, turn it into its own set. So people have to buy even more. <laughs> Darmanitan. Oh, man, you've got five V cards and one full art. That's not good. But, you know, if you get one more full art and it is the Charizard, it's not going to matter. So cross your fingers for the hot pools, mister. Panpour. Any thoughts, uh, thoughts on how much the two new Zards will go for? Probably a lot of money. Probably a lot of money, and Champion's Path will probably sell out like crazy, like Hidden Fates did. It probably won't even be close. Yes, Champion's Path will sell out in stores in the first day. That's what I think. It'll sell out in the first day by scalpers. Scalpers who are aware of the popularity of Pokemon right now, they'll be buying up... They'll be buying up the Darkness of Blaze off the shelves of Walmart just to resell to you on eBay. Then there's all the collectors who understand the value of a secret rare Charizard. They're going to be hitting those shelves too just to pick up the secret rare Charizard and get him graded. Charizard V, all right, one of the better V cards. But, man, you got a lot of V cards and not a lot of full arts. What is going on right now? The Charizard V is good, though. Trust me, that's a good card. Dude, he's got two packs left, guys. Here we go. This better be a full art, mister. Yes, it is. Full Art Vigavolt. Well, <laughs> one more. Nope, it's green. Wow, this is just like that other box. Dude, these are tough boxes. What is up with Darkness of Blaze, man? All right. Well, just a reminder, guys. Again, if you want to reserve a box of Champions, Fa Champions Path through the medium, you're welcome to do that, okay? All right.
right. We've also seen really hot boxes come out of this. All right. Let's see what you did get, though. So the Charizard V is your best card here. You've got Scissor, Salamence, Santa Scorch, Rhyperior, Eternatus, Scissor V, Full Art, and Vicavolt V, Full Art. I had three boxes, and they were real stingy. But I pulled this art. Stingy. St stingy. Stingy. It's Mark Finch, right? Mark Finch? Mark Finch. Let's get this into a bag. Crazy, man. Mark Finch. What's your favorite affordable box? You want to you wanna know my secret? Um, My favorite affordable box affordable box is still cosmic eclipse cosmic eclipse is at the top of my buy list right now mark finch i wouldn't tell you that guys unless we were best friends so we're done with the medium and the person who filled the medium last who was it i don't even remember do i have the card still i would sacrifice my own life I mean, Darkness Ablaze right now is still is pretty hot, but uh, yeah, Darkness Ablaze is pretty hot. Let's see, who did we do last? Last Tyler Limehouse, Gus Espinoza, Zero. It was Zero. Zero was the last one we did. Arsha Aiden says one spot, large middle. All right, you got it. Where do I, how do I send you my address? How's it going, Mark? You need to contact me in Discord. Go back to the description. There's a, you know, how to participate, right? Go to that part of the description and read it. It'll give you a link to Discord. You'll pop in there. You're gonna find my profile on the sidebar. You're gonna see I have a little crown next to my name. It'll say Card Economist, it'll have a little crown. You're gonna right click my name and you're gonna send me a private message. And you're gonna say, hey, it's me. I got the box, Mark Finch. And I wanna, you know, here's my address. And then I'll give you additional instructions from there, okay? Tyler Limehouse, two rounds of Rebel, one Hidden Fates. I have a box. Damn, Tyler's never given up. <clears throat> Tyler's never going to give you up, never going to let you down. Holy. Holy. One, two, three, four, five. Oops. Oops. I'm dropping them now. I'm getting tired, guys. Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Do, 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 do. Russ, can you come back as a ghost and tell me which packs are hot, please? Sneep. One, two. Three, four. Five, six. Seven, eight. Nine, ten, and the Hib, eleven. Ooh, ooh. Let's see. What do we got on the Hib? Charge R nine. All right, Charge R nine is actually not bad. Now the Rebel Clash. We got green, green. Here's a white back with nothing in it. <laughs> Here's another white back. And it's got Cinderace in it. Nice. Charizard, Cinderace, huh? Which one you think is cooler, guys? Cinderace or Charizard? Obviously Charizard. Cinderace is like, I don't know, man. He looks strange. What is he, like a football player? Oh, man. Pulling the secret rare Milo. Congratulations. All right. That got much hotter near the end. <laughs> secret rare Milo and another green. There we go. Rebel Clash Secret Rare Milo. Milo the Milo. He's so buff. Do you think girls simp for Milo? I don't know. He's got kind of a baby face, though. That's kind of weird, right? Milo with the baby face. Cinderace is Greninja 2.0. Yeah, maybe that's what they were going for. T-Lime. Milo Lily's dad? <laughs> All right. Cool. Very cool, man. Thanks for letting us watch all those polls. I sharp. Pre-grade my bag. Where's I sharp? 
Never gonna let you down. Do 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 do. Scooby doo doo be doo. That's Pokey Polego, dude. Here we go. Mister, I am getting tired. Wanna wake me up with some hot poles? Ten on the greens Where's exploration. All right, he's a nine. This is very close. I'm going to say plus nine. It's got some tilting that makes it off center, but it's not too bad. That's got a weird, a, a large white spot on the side, so it's clearly not a 10. Wobbuffet, off center. Mega Blastoise. Ah, oh, it's a pity. It's off center at the bottom. All right. It was looking good at the top. Poliwath. Does anyone really want to grade Poliwath? Yeah, he's off center. He's got like some weird white line on the top. Mega Venusaur. Clearly off center. This shows you how hard it is to get good cards, guys. Tens. This is why tens. This is why tens go for so much money. You have a shot. I would say minus ten on this one. That one's slightly off center, the Pikachu. It's certainly not a black label. <laughs> it's not a black label ten. He's a valuable card, Surfing Pikachu is. He becomes off-centered down here. I would say plus nine, but I honestly think it's just going to be a nine. But I guess that's the point of the plus nine. Like, you might have a shot, but it's kind of a higher risk card, so why bother? That's a nine. You know what I mean? Like, because if it comes back a nine, you're not going to make, like, money, you know what I mean? Nine. All right. So you see, almost all of it, all of his cards were nines, almost all of them, and that's why people buy PSA cards because when they're already graded ten, you go, oh good. So according to me, your only ten, your only clear ten is the Greens Exploration. That's a thirty-three dollar grade. Surfing Pikachu has a shot. These two are probably nines. All right. But you never know, because Streamlabs sent back that Mewtwo. And the Mewtwo was obviously a 9, and they graded it a 10, because they're bad. Because they're bad. We've got two kill. What's up, man? Mister, I'm getting tired. Wanna wanna wake me up with wanna wake me up with some hot poles. One round, darkness of balls. You got it. Darkness of balls. He says, tempting, tempting. <laughs> Sneep. 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 All right. What do we got? That's green. Two kills. Like, want to wake me up? Wake me up. Wake me up inside. Wake me up inside. How about that? Was that good? Did I wake you up inside? Staravi Stara Staravia? Staravia? What kind of goofy ass bird is that? That's not a Pidgeot. That's not Gen 1. All right, here's your chance for your Charizard VMAX right here. Are you ready? Nope, hollow. How about the next pack? Oh, here's your chance for the Charizard. You ready? It's Salamence. It's Salamence. Salamence, your favorite boy. What the? That's not a Charizard. Where's the Charizard? I was promised Charizards. Scott Burke, Smarg. Two kill. Where's two kill? Two kill. Did you not have a bag? I thought you had a bag. Are you up here? You're not up here. I thought two kill had a bag. Now he's not up here. He says, I do have a bag. All right. Sky Blue, Toonami, Super, Tyler Hardister, Scott Burke, Smarg, Slither in that booty, Sam 2, Simple, Snorlax, sneaky sup. Hmm. Oh, oh, you do have a bag. I'm sorry. So, I'm thinking of your name here with the T to kill, but it actually starts with the next. I found you. I found you. You're in the Z box. I found you. Tyler Limehouse, dude. One round darkness and three hibs for Tiki Takis. Damn, dude. Wait, is it all for Tiki Takis? Hell yeah. If, if it's all for Tiki Takis, we'll do it all for Tiki Takis. I don't mind.
All right, so Tyler Limehouse. And he's going to have three Hib, which is actually really expensive, and five Darkness of Blaze. All right, we're pretty full on TikTok, so we don't need any more TikToks. Wow. Wow, great. Perfect. We're all done for the night. Don't buy anything else, guys. We're at five hours. It's time to wrap up because I'm a tired boy and I'm going to die from butt cancer if I sit too long. Great. So the next thing we're doing is the giveaway. We did not reach 200 likes. So unfortunately, it would just be the small and medium. But we are doing the giveaway. And what you'll want to do is head over to the general chat and go ahead and guess a number between 1 and 100. He says, wait, Mr. TCC, put me down. All right, let me look you up, Russ. Russ, did we miss you somewhere? Let's see. Your boy, Russ. Ultra Prism for TikTok. All right. Sorry about that, Russ. I can't believe I missed that. Here you go, Russ. There you go, mister. We fixed it. We'll do them side by side so that you can win. You guys don't guess here. You guess in the Discord. Every time we do this, this happens. Everyone's like, all right, I guess right here. It's das boot. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. We got that. When you have time, can you check my charge of VMAC I requested for PSA grading? I don't see my name. That's because he's not been submitted yet. Ta-da. Let's see. Let's jump over to the general chat now. General chat. Here it is, general chat. And we are going to go ahead and lock up general chat now. Permissions. I will be army and def defend Pakistan and destroy India. All right, it's all locked up. Let's find out who wins. Landed on 15. That means we, we're going to uh, roll three times. That's 14 plus 7, which makes 21. Plus 15, 21 and 15 is 36. 36 is the winning number. 36. Take it or leave it. Who came closest to 36 without going over? Oh, Tyler, you were so close, man. 37. Gus has 33. Gus has 33. Gus is the winner on 33. Gus S. Congratulations, Gus. Gus with the 33. All right. Creep. Creep. What do you think of that, Kitty? Kitty, what do you think of that? Kitty, what do you think of that? Are you tired? She's tired. <laughs> All right. So, I'm not going to add a spot. I'm just going to remove a spot. So, I'm losing $10 on that. That's fine. Gus Esp. I like to add spots. It's, it's actually a form of inflation, but that's okay. That's okay. It's still a gift for you. All right. I want to thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.